name. It did cut all your hair. Yeah. Um. I have no idea what that is. I should probably turn it off. That's been. It looks like Conor time. McGregor. <laughs> with a Viking hat on. Maybe it is. It is well knit. It could be him. Anyway, uh, he's looking awkward right welcome now. Welcome everybody to another episode of the UNG Odyssey podcast. Um, yeah, we're just talking about something that's on the TV here, but it's not important because we need to talk about what is going on. What's that drink you drinking? Uh, this is the lemon cleanse drink and I just drink it regularly you now because it tastes good uh, I don't want to do that what's going on back there is that a delay oh uh, yeah I don't know I'm not going to mess with it um unfortunately our guest today had to cancel because his child got sick and you know how that goes with little kids It'll just scratch my heart when they get sick everybody has to stay home you gotta sniff it once you scratch it Get them dead cells going. Oh my goodness. Woo-wee. And then to make it... I haven't showered in two days. <laughs> I, I just remembered. <laughs> I haven't changed in two days. Why not? Because, like, I I ran around after I worked a 13-hour shift yesterday. And, um... Well, people are probably thinking that's even more of a reason to take a shower after working. Yeah, yeah. No, but no. But I ran around. And after, after I got off, I ran around. And then by the time I got home, it was, like, five hours later. And then I had to be at work in six hours. And then the UFC Jesus fights were on, yeah. and another thing happened, and I ate at 9, and I shouldn't have ate at 9. Let me sniff it again real quick. Oh, that's oh, gross. Okay, Christ. what about the, and was then, that the uh, first day or the second day? That was yesterday, that, so was, that was the second no, day. No, that was the first day. Today's okay. the second day yeah. I haven't showered. Jesus Christ, go. Yeah, that's um, how I roll. Real man, <laughs> manry. Uh, and then you don't use deodorant either. Oh, yeah, I don't wear deodorant at all. Yeah. <laughs> I, use, I use baking soda. Now, for, what do you do with that? Do you just put the powder on? Yeah, I, like, I do this. Uh-huh. And I sniff a couple. <sighs> and then I go, one for you, and then do the other one. <laughs> and then I let my armpit sniff the, <laughs> sniff the line, and then... <sighs> and then I get another line, and... Uh huh. Do my teeth. All in the same hand. All in the same hand. Armpit hand. It's a glorious hand. Oh, After man. I wipe my ass, I do that. I don't even know where to go from there. You look you get, like you got. <laughs> you look you like you got <laughs> curls like. Uh, like what? Like you curled your hair to look like that. Like on the on the camera, it looks worse than in real life. Like it looks like straight up curls right there. Look. <laughs> I got that Rick James hair. Yeah, right? you do. <laughs> Give it to my baby. Give it to me. <laughs> like Dave Chappelle when he came out. I'm the baddest. Him. I'm the baddest, richest, <laughs> best looking. It just uh, well, I've been. I switched to. Uh, I might switch off a bit though. But I switched to like a conditioner made for curls and then some kind of curly oil hair. So it's making it really more curly. And yeah, that's cool. But I mean, I don't really care. Most of yeah. the time, I keep it in ponytail anyway. And it's just hair. Hair of that. Speaking of, you totally chopped off all your hair out of nowhere. You yeah. Went from long hair to mohawk to no hair and like. Two oh, days. did I get the mohawk on the? You thing? had it for a little bit. I don't think no, I you didn't really it. show it off. Man, it was cool. Um, no, yeah, cause you did just, it on three days. It's 2019. It's time for a change. I've lost some weight. <laughs> but you barely grew the hair out in 2018. Yeah. No, I mean, don't get me wrong. It's gonna grow back, but I just I want to like grow this year. I don't know. I've been doing a lot of. A lot of what? Soul searching? Well, a lot of watching Ancient Aliens, which makes me do soul searching. It's like, fuck, we ain't shit. Ancient Aliens. That's a good show. Yeah. What do you think about uh, Japan going to the other side of the moon? Do you think there's any excitement in that at all for you? I think they lied about it. You think they're lying about it? I mean, I think they did, but uh, they do. I don't know. I don't know what's going on up there. Ooh, they're playing like Star Wars or something. That's cool. <clears throat> yeah. I like Star Wars. The fuss is strong in this one. <laughs> <laughs> but they kind of been fucking it up. Oh, yeah. Star Wars now is garbage. I'm sorry. Yeah. I don't like... like it. I didn't like what? Force Awakens, which was the first new one. Uh-huh. And then I didn't like the second one that much. But I like the second one more than the first one. We could argue about it all night. If you want. Are you talking about... Uh... You like the second one where he kills his dad? Where he kills her? No, 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 that's the first one. That's the first one. What's the second one then? The second one is where they're on a spaceship and it's like a slow chase the whole movie. I'm coming for you. 
you're not. But I'm behind you. Oh, that's the one where Princess Leia got into that coma? Which made no yeah, sense. Yeah, it was all dumb. That it was lame. No sense at We're in a all. coma for two hours only. <laughs> yeah, because when Gio blow, first watched blow it, up. he told me about it. Yeah, she, um, he, I think it was like a missile or something. Or yeah, something. Like one of their she beams. like flew out into space and she said, no, wait a minute, I'm alive and I'm coming back. Yeah, like she's, that, so what she's the there? only one that can survive space. Nobody's ever talked about it like that. Uh, like, like I don't know. Maybe she. It would have been cool if like she would have been like, if she would have like had some kind of the force help her out. Like it would like, like kind of like when they did with like. You know how you know woman. it's bullshit. Huh. It's because a wizard couldn't do it. That Gorvis Clavis guy or Clavis Gorvis or whatever the fuck he's called oh. from Avengers. <laughs> He couldn't do guy. it. He just he went out. He's like, oh, shit, in space. I'm frozen. <laughs> and here I go, floating into space. <laughs> Where are you going? Yeah. Huh? No, I'm, going, I was going? doing it for the camera. But, uh, mm. you know, that, that shot yeah, yeah. was like him flying towards the camera and you just see his eye. Yeah, like, yeah, like get the frozen. And little eyes, too. <laughs> like, oh. <laughs> that was weird. He didn't have a nose. Yeah, it was weird. Uh, what do you call him, Squidward? Yeah. <laughs> great movie, though. It was I, I watched movie. it over and over. And sometimes on some uh, enhancements, uh-huh. and Jesus, it's it's better on enhancements. Yeah, it's good. It's a good movie. Oh yeah, I just there's just stupid parts in that movie. I don't. There like are to talk some about dumb it. parts, but every movie, no 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 movie's perfect. Uh, Civil War is pretty much close to perfect. Yeah, but it's still not. Uh, perfect. Winter Soldier is better than Civil War. Black Panther's really good, except some parts. Dumb. Mm-hmm. Let's see what other um, movies. I was watching this YouTuber talk about Black Rocket Panther. Rocket Four is amazing. Uh, <laughs> Bloodsport, um, Blood Predator, Sport. Predator is perfect. Um, it was good. Yeah. Jaws. Oh, Jaws are you kidding great, me, man? The way that they, they, they didn't make you the way the dolls' the eyes just kind of shine back lifeless <laughs> and they roll back. <laughs> Yeah, I didn't know the quotes from that Why guy. Why does everything sound the same voice that I just bring up over and over? <laughs> no. yeah. Imagine when he goes to order something like he was at TGF, right? Yeah. I like that. Yeah. Can I get the black coffee? Oh, very black coffee. No sugar. No, no sugar. There's are so good reflection back into your face. So I can look into it. I swear I'm staring at my soul all black <laughs> That was a cool guy, man. Oh, he was that awesome. That dude was great in every, yeah. almost everything he did, I think. He should have played Popeye. He would have been a creepy-ass Popeye. He looked like that. That one chick who played who? What was that Olive chick? Olive oil? Yeah, Olive oil. Who was that, that actor? Oh, that was the... <coughs> Where is she from? She's from... She was in a... Uh, she looked so familiar, too. She was... Oh, oh. Uh, oh, no, a family guy did a thing about her. And he's all like, Hi, I'm... What's her name? But she was also in a. Uh, she was in The Shining. Yeah, that's her. She it's looks like, all it's weird. Like, it's like Tracy McGavin or something. It's like, like she survived doing drugs a lot and came back, <laughs> and it just looks like. Are you on drugs? I no, used to be. Drugs. I've been sober for five years. Ah, your tricks. Yeah. Um. She family. I'm falling like, for that one. And then like, hi, I'm just gonna make up a name. Like, I think it's like Tracy McGavin. It's like it's like it's like that time that I I met Tracy McGavin and she walk he walks up to her and she's like hi I'm Tracy McGavin he's like who the fuck cares <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> now but speaking of Popeye uh, what's that skit on Family Guy where he's all like you're there's tumors in your forearms and he's, 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 and he's just saying like it sounds like he's singing a song ask him excuse me excuse me you, 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 like you had a stroke. <laughs> That's why your face doesn't work on one side. <laughs> the fact that you're still alive is amazing. <laughs> it's just talking. <laughs> but the cartoons, though, are oh. just as funny as that skit. They are. Because he'd be like, and what are you going to do about it? Well, what am I going to do about it? <laughs> like, he used to have the whole conversation to himself. Yeah, he just starts But loud enough for you to kind of hear. Like, what are you saying? After I'm done with this bitch, I'm going to smoke a joint. <laughs> like, what the fuck? Mm-hmm. I'm going to bang a wrong. I haven't seen of... Popeyes in forever. Oh, man. dude. Popeyes hilarious. Uh, I think you could YouTube it. Everything's on YouTube, right? Yeah, everything's on YouTube. It's just, it's just not something like, that I, I always there. YouTube uh, old... 
Three Stooges skits because oh those are great. Those oh, Three Stooges were hilarious. Day, day. Definitely day, day, day. hated by every woman. I don't, have you really? ever met a woman that never liked Three Stooges? You know what? I can't say that I have. They always say it's really stupid, and right? I'm like that's what I love about it. Right. <laughs> <laughs> <clears throat> um, yeah, ah, I've never eh? met a woman. <laughs> <laughs> I'll sue you for this. Huh, superstitious, eh? <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, I, I don't think I've thought about that for a while. I've never met an actual woman that actually says she likes three stitches. Yeah, <clears throat> like which, I, is, I, which makes it even cooler. Yeah, I was like, <laughs> I was like for that reason alone, I like it. <laughs> I need to have That's a another bar. reason. And you have a bar where they play nothing but Three Stooges skits. At that, oh. that way, no woman wants to be Then there. nobody would be in the bar. They're all trying to get laid. <laughs> would be a bunch of guys just hanging out. No, that does, that's never happened that in life. That could happen. I mean, yeah, oh, okay, I got a promotion. Come on, guys, let's go hang out. Uh, but uh, by the end of the night, everybody's gone, and they're all trying to bang prostitutes or whatever. Well, I mean, well, I mean they can just walk outside and bang. It'd be a great place for prostitutes to see, hang out in. See, if the they... Prostitutes be outside. Well, there you go. Mother. See, if they had prostitutes on... on Deck, so to speak. No, but uh, <laughs> uh, <laughs> then they go bang thought? one out and then go watch Three Stooges. Everybody would have a great night. Who would have thought that the on, on deck, deck would, would be a scene? Yeah, yeah, it's fucking been said by by like pirates and all that. All hands on yeah. deck, <laughs> sweep the poop deck, yeah, or whatever. And yeah, uh, on deck, yeah. It's like Johnny Depp at the Pirates. It's like if we're all uh, captains or something, or if we actually have been on deck. I've never been on a deck in my life. No. <laughs> <laughs> the I'm, only I, deck I, I know is, oh, I deck the guy. It, but it's said by a lot of black people. It's like, you know, none of you guys have been on the boat since you guys came over I think anything back said by black people is said by all people right now. Because, like... That's yeah, true. You know, you just make it popular, and, and the black people are kind of the cool people to em- emulate mm-hmm. right now. So everybody's like, oh shit, they're saying it and they're cool. I want to say it too. Which is cool. I mean, do what you do. And I, you know shit, I, I get on it too. Uh, but it's just it's just funny. I think, I think it, well, I find it funny. But I think it's funny to me how black people say that essay, like they call man, Hispanics essays. And like, we don't even call each other essays. But I don't think, <laughs> like, we're different though compared to other people. Cause, <clears throat> no, but like even I, like even in like even the the real Mexican guys, they don't. They don't well, the real say. Mexican guys don't say that. Like I've never heard that. And, like I, I think that's from a movie or no, something. My I think man. That on some movie. Like teacher. No, no, no. It's real. It, I think it's more of a California thing. Is it? I've never heard anybody call another guy. I've heard it, plenty. How often do you go to California? Never, but. uh there's people that say that, like Bob says essay. I think uh, uh, Sam is it Sam? Who? The that guy from California? That's a truck driver or used to be a truck driver. I don't know who that guy is. Um, <coughs> uh, let's not talk about work. Work stupid. We're not talking about work. We're talking yeah. about a guy who used to be a truck driver. Guy used to be a truck driver. Uh, what were we talking about? Oh yeah, the bar with hookers outside. Uh, and, and you have an extra idea for it? Ah, uh, it, it, it would. We're it gonna would make kinda, it happen. It kind of be like an un, unintentionally no woman's allowed bar. Cause no, no ma'am. Woman, yeah, no. <laughs> <laughs> no ma'am. Which is another great show. I don't think any. That's that's a show that's intended for men, though. You know what I mean? What? Like nobody. Oh, that one. No, yeah. If a woman likes that show, then that's kind of you like women. <laughs> <laughs> You're a woman that likes women. You mean a lesbian? No, I don't know what it's called. There's a term for it. I don't know if it's a lesbian. It might be Lesbot 2000 or something like that. The Lesbot 2000? Yeah. That's... Uh, yeah, I don't think too many women. But it's funny, though, because even though the wife, what was her name? Peg? Peg. Peg was a stay-at-home wife. She embraced the fact that she was a stay-at-home wife, and nowadays she 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 would have been great like as as a uh, stay-at-home wife now because all they do is stay at home. And they're, work all, out. they're all they're all yeah. they all work out and whatnot. Well, I don't even know if they work out. He got lucky; she actually did something, she, which is work out. She, she did nothing high. else. But um, man, he didn't want to bang her. He never wanted to bang her. He never did want to bang her. She's like, a love woman. She's like, are you kidding me? That piece of ass right there. I'd go round. That's. That's like a... Why did I turn into a cat? I don't know. That's a hot chick Ounce. who's so annoying, you just don't want her to be with you, but you married her somehow. That's the whore that you marry. That's the uh, the Chandler's annoying girlfriend mm. person. 
Yeah, that's, that's the, right. That's he, he, Yeah, that's what happened. He it's married funny, the whore, and he's like, fuck, up, I'm stuck with her. Funny you bring and yeah, she did have friends. it. In, huh? <laughs> funny you bring up a quote from Friends. What? Or a scene from Friends. Oh, I don't know what I was... Oh, I was watching uh, something about 90s, and all this shit was refreshed. Oh, was head. it that 90s show that yeah. they had on, uh, Netflix? on Netflix? Yeah, I've tried watching some of it. I haven't gotten to it. I hear you. I, I watched like half of it, and I was ready to go to sleep. <sighs> but uh, Sister was around, and she was watching it and enjoying it. <laughs> So I was like, all right, I'll enjoy it too. Oh, that's right, you did with Elsa. How is that anyway? It's not bad. It's cool. Yeah, I mean, Elsa usually keeps a pretty clean, tight. She's house. never there. She's never there. Yeah, it's cool. <laughs> it's like you have your own house. Yeah, but I, I'm like, <laughs> like you're the one stuck hello? at home. With, you're the one stuck at home with a cat and dog. Hello. Speaking of the cat, how is Sessie's cat treating you? I ignore it. <laughs> Does they leave you alone? I mean, yeah. If, if you ignore it, I mean, she's just like, you looking at me? Better not be looking at me. You looking at me? <laughs> ah, you're not looking at me. I'm looking at you. Know. <laughs> yeah, her cat's cre- uh, crazy. But, but like, excuse me. When you try to, do you ever try to touch him? No, 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 no. I don't. Would she? I don't. Probably. I'm sure she would. <laughs> She's mean. I'm sure she'd go a step above <clears throat> his. You know, you, you go for the pet. Yeah. You barely touch two uh, strands of hair, and just <laughs> cat claw all the way up. Ah! And it's that uh. Oh, it's another Friends thing. Where he's running around in the background, <laughs> twirling the cat around. <laughs> that was on Friends? Uh, I'm sure it was on other things, but <laughs> they copied that shit. It's like a stuffed animal and it's yeah. just fighting. Uh, oh, dude. I saw a thing. <clears throat> it reminds me of In Living Color. Oh, I love In Living Color. I don't know The why. background I, guy? Yeah, that's that, been going he's, on. He's going on like uh, sh- there's a girl on the news and there's a guy in the background doing yeah, it's Jim like Carrey, he's stealing, kind of weird. Uh, robbing the bags and... <laughs> Doing all types of <laughs> shit. He's on like a unicycle. Uh, I wish I could hop pop that one of those skits in right now, but this, that shit was hilarious. Oh, those in Living Color was, uh, yeah, it was, yeah. It's a, that's another. It changed show. the game. That's another show that you know. It, I didn't know, but it was the first show to be written, produced, pretty much the first <clears throat> like all black uh, produced show. Yeah, written, directed, all that shit. I was like, wow, I didn't know that. Which yeah, the Waynes, I mean, they were also, the, yeah. He was a beast when he made that show. Man, I, don't, I don't know if they got paid enough for that show, man. I'm, I'm they sure did. they didn't. But Jesus, like, I love, I love that. I love that show. I mean, so many good made, skits. They were made pretty good money. Good. Well, they came out all right, I think. <clears> yeah. 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 Not everybody. That one really skinny guy. The really small one. Uh, like, he made a few Something movies. Davidson? He was yeah, in, he, he was in, he was in the... Ace Ventura when nature calls. Yeah, he's a little guy. <laughs> <laughs> that was him. Like, you, you, think, you think it was the big buff guy who was gonna fight? I was like, oh shit! Uh, he then he turns around, around and took backpack. Guy. He's, he's back there. Like, gonna fight backpack guy. He's, he's back there just having a seizure. Like, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> and the big guy's scared. Like, oh, don't bite my finger. <laughs> uh, that was hilarious. But what a great I don't know, movie! Man, it just great had me. movie. It, is, it was a great movie. Part one was hilarious too. I think part two was way better though. That's one of those rare instances where part two was better than the one. <laughs> I one. tripped out the time where he, they're on the road and he's all like jerking. Yeah, around. and it's a smooth <laughs> <kid's> road. <laughs> the guy's just staring at him like, "What the hell's wrong with you?" The, have you ever seen it not on TV? Because you know we watched it on TV yeah. when we were younger. I well, think I did once. Okay, well <laughs> let me tell you because I have the Blu-ray. And I'll probably let you borrow it if you want to. But he's actually masturbating in that room. Yeah, he was I drinking never knew it. That. He was beating it off under... under. Well, I was a kid when I was watching I was like, what's going on? I don't understand How did you not scene. know that? Because I wasn't jerking it. He was, he was like, whoa, <laughs> my... <coughs> oh, and they show her titties, too, I think. Oh, yeah, I do remember seeing her titties. She has some nice tits. Oh, yeah. She was know, hot. Who was that actor? Who knows? She was hot. She, I think she came out a few other things, too. But she was smoking... Yeah. Oh, sexy bitch right there. Uh, and not too many of the black chicks have perky titties, so when you find one, uh, that's, I, nice. I, that's a lie. That's, that's true. Lie. I've seen, well, any of them that I've messed with definitely don't have perky titties. <laughs> <laughs> so, but, but uh, I've seen some pictures. <laughs> Maybe they photoshop like, them. Like it's that chick, Hattie Berry. Oh, those are kind of saggy. I was not. That's that's like um, Olivia Munn. When Olivia Munn showed her titties, I was like, oh man, he kind of ruined it for me. You know who I 
great tits. That one chick from, uh, uh, ooh, I don't think you know this, but she came on the, uh, the Percy Jackson movies. I don't know those. <clears throat> uh, she came out in that movie with The Rock. Which was like her daughter. The one where everything uh, is destroyed. No. <clears throat> oh, uh, the San Diego? San Andreas Fault? Yeah, yeah. I've never seen that. No, yeah, it's a garbage movie. <coughs> There's another yeah, one where he's got no leg and he's in a tower. <laughs> <laughs> Somebody made a joke, so it was like a... What was it? Something something mixed with uh, Die Hard. Yeah. <clears throat> it, it's a ridiculous concept. I keep hearing that Die Hard is the best Christmas movie of all time. And I don't, I don't, I don't, see I don't think I've ever Christmas. seen Die Hard completely because I don't, I can't get through it. I'm sorry. It's cool. I mean, it's action, fun, Meh. fun action. It's I'm, just... Bruce Willis was good in <laughs> Pulp Fiction. Yeah, he was great in Pulp Fiction. Uh, it's so wait cool. a minute, that was John Travolta. It was so. Cool. <laughs> well, he was in there too. I know he was, but he wasn't that good. He was kind of quiet in that movie. <laughs> uh, I don't. I'm sure he's good in something. I that was horrible. okay. The the shooting movie, the old western that's not uh-huh. very good, but it's pretty good. The shooting old western. Yeah, but anyways, I was gonna say something when it came to Bruce Willis. I don't remember. Hey, look. So we got some people watching, <clears throat> but <clears throat> so oh, speaking of this guy, makes me think of him. His name's Micah Brown. He's a great, what up? He's funny, funny ass comic. But he looked. He reminds me of a uh, Daniel Day Lewis. Oh, oh yeah, 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 and I always think of that one kick-ass movie, uh, Bad Gangs of New York. Oh, yeah. what a great movie. <laughs> that was so cool. What a great movie. I don't movie. know who directed that, but that was hilarious, especially when they had the firemen fighting each other, or who was going to put oh, out the fire. Be- yeah. <laughs> that made no fucking That was sense. awesome. Oh, man. <laughs> I love that. Can yeah. you imagine that happening now? That would be hilarious. Like, they you know, fighting yeah. like Pokemon or something. <laughs> What do you mean they're fighting like Pokemon? No, they'd be like, all right, we're going to battle now, and they'd whip out their Pokemon cards or something. They wouldn't oh, literally physically uh, fight. I thought you meant an actual fight. Like, they all got into they Everybody would run into that one car scene, and they're fighting over who helps the person out of the car. Oh, I don't know. <clears throat> no, no, no. no. What, a, what a great movie, though. Yeah, Liam Neeson's in that movie. He makes some great cameos. He was in... Uh, Neeson? That, yeah. What else was he like? He, he was he, in that Star Wars movie. He was Qui Gon Jinn. Oh yeah, uh, he was. He was the the trainer, wasn't he? One of the masters. Yeah, he was the master of uh, Obi Wan Kenobi. Man, that, and uh, actually, how did uh, he Count die? Dooku, uh, Count Dooku trained uh, Qui Gon. Uh-huh. Um, Which one was Count Dooku? Count Dooku's the one that's kind of the villain in part two. That ends up being the one that, uh, that is, is making the deal to get the the army of droids. And then he gets killed in part three. Dooku? Yeah. Right before the... Oh, no. It wasn't the no, robot No, he's the one guy, with the clones. It? Huh? Count Dooku wasn't the robot guy. No, that's uh, General Grievous. Oh, okay. Which is awesome, too. <clears throat> Man, those movies were better than we're giving them credit for. I, I hate this talk about it. No, and the working. fighting, way better in those movies than the old school movies. I'm oh, than the old school movies? Yeah, the old school movies. Dude, the other one was like... <laughs> Yeah. Well, you better you not predict the next move. Watch this. Oh, how did he know it was coming up on this one? It's like old people with canes fighting each other. Yeah. And they're like tired after three swings. How does he keep blocking this? No, the fighting never really got better. The choreography got way better. Oh, way better. Then the first two. The first and, three, then, right? and then the first one with Darth Maul doing flips and shit. With a double lightsaber? Yeah. Are you fucking serious? If I was doing that, I would have cut my legs off on purpose. I'm like, hell yeah, and then was, I did like the, the... I do remember the battle between the, the Count guy, where he gets up... Do you and think that... I mean, it, I'm sure it hurts, but do you think it really hurts? Because it, like, it cuts off, and at the same time, like, you know, quarter... What is it called? Quarterizes. Yeah, quarterizes. Um... I'm like, ah! I mean, uh, but you know what? I can still move this around. <laughs> There's no blood coming out. Watch me lick it. It's fine. <laughs> you know what I mean? That tastes a little, a little toasty. What is that, ham? It tastes like baked turkey. <laughs> what is that? Yeah, what if it tastes like ham? I'm going to take a nap now. You know, there's no uh, further medical assistance needed. It's done. <laughs> there is it. Uh, what were we talking about? I again? don't know. Maybe it's just the thought that your hands got on that freaks you out more than anything. 
Oh, I'm sure. Because I'm, I'm pretty sure, like... It's like, know. oh, yeah, nobody's around? Oh, there's nothing there. <laughs> <laughs> Fuck. That is true. <laughs> People who have their limbs cut off don't realize, like, they don't, subconsciously don't know, they their mind still thinks it's there. So you would actually, yeah, you probably would, like, yeah. you'd go to comb your hair and be like, oh, shit, it's not there no more. Yeah. Speaking of uh, real quick, speaking of combing hair, uh, when I broke my hand, uh-huh. you know, I, I slept at Jimmy's, uh, <coughs> and he told me I picked up my broken hand and went. <coughs> and like, I was there, and, and like I, I went ow. I, I remember I went, that happening one time. Your your hand was all busted, and you were laying down, and then you were just like scratching your face <laughs> with your hand or something. I was like, I thought his hand was broken. <laughs> Nobody scratches their face when their hands broken. He's faking it. I trace you, myth buster buster. <laughs> oh, man. Yeah, trace buster buster. And you never went to the doctor to get that thing care of, did you? I went, but they said it was healed already, so I was like, all right, fuck Well, you. did they say what was wrong with it initially? They said it was broken. <laughs> <laughs> what do you mean? <laughs> they said it was broken? <laughs> uh, yeah, that's what I was wondering. Like, did they say they, they could tell where it was cracked or whatever? Oh, yeah, there? yeah. They showed me the x-ray and everything. It's like, yeah, your bone's doing this right there. And and uh, to tell you the truth, at that angle, we'd usually bust it and fix it. But you're done growing, so do you really want to fix it? <laughs> you're done I, growing? I was like, well, yeah, my bone's not growing anymore or whatever, so it wouldn't yeah. grow out weird or whatever. So where's the bone at? So, oh, it's right so there. technically it goes in and then goes down? It's like it goes, it's supposed to go straight. Yeah. But it broke, so it's like my straight part on the knuckle goes uh-huh. up at an angle, and the, the one that's supposed to go straight connecting it, it goes like that. <laughs> and up. <laughs> so it's you can see it protruding. It looks like a... Oh, wait. I never noticed that. It's always like that. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Why do you think I haven't punched you in so long? <laughs> you did punch me all the time. Well, what, what about this? Did they, um, did they say what would happen if you punched somebody? I'm sure it'll break really easily. And, like, it's funny because, like, look, I think it's bruised right now. I think so. Yeah, so I'll, like, smack things on accident. I'm like, oh, fuck. Like, because my bone's pointing out so much. Yeah, it is bruised. Maybe I touched it too much. I don't know. Yeah, it bruises really easily. Look, it's bruised right now. (laughs) So creepy, man. Yeah, please don't try to fight me because I won't fight back. (laughs) You just backhand somebody with a bone. Oh, no, that'll break my head. Yeah, but they were all like, I was like, so at this angle, should I get it fixed? Like, yeah, you should, but I mean, it's up to you. I'm like, nah, I'm good. I walked out. <laughs> but even though they said, yeah, you should get it fixed. Well, I mean, because like, it, it'll probably hurt really bad when I'm older. Yeah. Right, right now, I'm fine. <laughs> oh. God damn it. Actually, it does suck when I do a lot of push-ups and stuff like that. Yeah, and you feel and uh, my weightlifting, yeah, I, I don't do that at all. That hurts it too? Weightlifting? Too much grip? Something about the angle and the bone. Yeah, it's not right. The bone. <laughs> <laughs> it's just not right. The bone. What the hell were we talking about? This is what I hate about <laughs> switching subjects so much. Well, we start off with <coughs> talking about that. Uh, <coughs> we start off with Popeye. Popeye, <laughs> Popeye and, and that, uh, that chick. That led us to other movies. Daniel Day Lewis. Um, man, I'm sure there was things I was gonna say about all of this. Oh, Daniel Day Lewis is awesome. He's a method actor. So even off camera, you gotta like on Lincoln, you gotta still call yeah. him Mr. President. I can only imagine giving him coffee. <laughs> here you go, Mr. Uh, here you go, Mr. Lewis. It's Mr. President. <laughs> bitch, you Lewis. What movie did he play? I president? ain't calling you no goddamn president. You ain't my president, you punk bitch. What movie did he come now, out as a president? You need to cut that acting shit out and take this goddamn coffee. <laughs> oh, so he knows, he's Thank another you. one of those, uh, those guys that stays He's a method character. actor. Yeah. He's a method actor. What they're called? They're called method actors. Method actors? Actor? Method actors. Man, that's so close to meth actors. Oh, they're meth actors. Believe me. That's just the same, like, the, the guy who played Joker... Uh, the new Joker was like that. Oh, was he? Oh, um... The guy from uh, that one band. No, Jared Leto? Yeah. Was he? Yeah, they said he was. They said he would send people packages with dead rats in them. You know who who they said took yeah. it overboard? Uh, because uh, Jim Carrey did method acting for uh, Man on the Moon, the Andy yeah. Kaufman. Yeah. And they said he did it overboard. Yeah, when he played that one guy. What was that guy's name? He, he almost fought Jerry Kigalala. <laughs> he almost really fought him because yeah. he was annoying the fuck out of him. Hell yeah. Um, there was something I was gonna... Oh, so Daniel Day-Lewis, 
Have you ever seen There Will Be Blood? It's on Netflix. I think I have. Okay, well, if you haven't, that movie is hilarious. I love that movie. He's so angry and... But it's funny? He comes oh, off as no, funny? No, no, no. Like... He doesn't, like, it's... I'm pretty sure it's a serious movie. But there's a part like a serious movie. where he, like, stomps on the guy. Uh-huh. Yeah, I think it's in a bowling alley. Maybe his bowling alley. And I just couldn't stop laughing. Because <laughs> of the way he was stomping him? Or no, what? no, because of... I don't remember what it was. I think he called him like a dumbass or something and then started whooping his ass and then just started killing him. And I was just like laughing hysterically. Like, I wish I could do that. <laughs> Jesus Christ, go. Yeah, you know. <laughs> I wish I could just stop a guy to death. No, it was hilarious. <laughs> no, because it's like, I think he was like bitch smacking him yeah. until he hit the ground and then he just started <laughs> stomping him. I don't remember. But I just remember laughing. What well, did the guy not want to fight back or get up and get uh, get out of there? I have Once no you idea. start getting, I mean, you start off with bitch slapping. That's not gonna hurt anybody that much. And then you fall yeah, down, and then you I get, think, starts getting. Stopped. I think a bitch slap hurts more than the fist. I don't know about it hurts that. Hurts your fucking. <laughs> it does hurt your ego. <laughs> it hurts your ego like a motherfucker. Ah! You're like you're shocked, and then, dude, what do I do? <laughs> <laughs> like what, like Charlie Murphy did when he got slapped. Was it slapped or punched? No, he got slapped. He slapped. Yeah, yeah. Like Charlie Murphy, he got slapped. Uh, what, what, what? <laughs> I was it's shocked that he died. Think about it. In medieval times, somebody took off their gloves, smacked another guy. <clears throat> like, I challenge you to a duel. Like, they fight. Somebody they fight to the death. Someone somebody had to go. <laughs> <laughs> oh, man. <laughs> that is true, man. They did fight to the death. That, that guy was crazy. times. That guy, Bernie Mac, hilarious. I didn't know Bernie Mac had a feud feud, feud with, what's his name? Who? Steve Harvey. Oh, I didn't know that. Yeah, they had a feud. Apparently, they didn't like each other. Uh, I forget what started off with it, I think. After a while, they didn't Steve like Harvey him. comes off with, I know everything. <clears throat> Maybe, and, but I don't know how he was back I then. I mean, don't get me wrong, he's cool, and, uh, and I've heard his <laughs> advice on shit. It's cool. It's right, it's pretty but is he one of those guys where you like bring up any kind of subject he knows about it? No, he just has a strong opinion on it, I guess. I don't know. He's well, what cool. if, I mean, well, but I'm saying like he's the, the kind of guy that he has a strong opinion about everything. Like, so I'm what sure. Do you think about I don't know. I mean, I don't know the guy. But... That's right there. Blah, blah, blah. I don't know. I love it when um, they do, like I've seen his talk show a couple times. They do little skits or whatever um, where... He, he has, like, women. Yeah. Like, sitting there or whatever. And then he has a woman in the audience ask him a question. Uh-huh. And he, he has, like, they ask him the question. And then the women in the background disagree. He's like, nah, god damn it, bitch. <laughs> well, he doesn't say bitch. But he's, yeah. like, telling them his point. He's like, all right, whatever. And I don't know. Maybe I watched a different show. I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> I was like, what is but in that? my head, this is what but was going on. Like- it sounds like, yeah, ask a woman a question and then you argue with her about her answer. <laughs> That's what you pretty much just said. No, no, she she's asking a question uh-huh. and then the women are all like, this is what you should do. And he's like, nah, fuck that. Oh. <laughs> oh, so like, they're... Because re- I see women shows do that too. Their response to her and then he says... And he says his response. Like, yeah. no, that's wrong. That's a horrible idea. Maybe I... I don't know. Maybe I dreamt it or something. But yeah, I don't think he did. That needs to happen more often. What, dreaming? No, men's opinion needs to come out. Oh, men's opinion? That's what you said, dreaming? <laughs> like, nobody cares about the man's opinion. No? It's no. like, wait a minute, wait a minute. You're a man? Okay, hold on, hold on. Before I ask your opinion, are you straight? Yes, I'm straight. All right, I don't care what you have to say. Like, what the fuck? <laughs> but it's funny, but we get asked about our opinion all the time by women that we date. Oh, <laughs> it's horrible. And, and then they don't like the advice? No, they don't. They never like the advice. Not once have I heard, that's... That's exactly what I'm going to do. That's a great idea. And if I did hear that, then it was bullshit and she didn't do it. Yeah, you know. I always, always, <clears throat> I always say like if I was one of her friends and her friend says the same thing to her, she'd be like, oh, that's a great idea. But because I said it, it's a horrible idea. <laughs> oh, I'm like that towards, towards them. <laughs> <laughs> I'll be like, what the hell do you know? And then sister will be like, you should do this. Sister, you're amazing. <laughs> but that's still... I just said that two minutes ago. No, you didn't. <laughs> but no, you didn't. Well, yeah, but that's your... And then fly through the window. Pew. 
<laughs> Luigi style, head first. Uh, <coughs> what else is going on? I don't know, man. What's going on with you? Mm-hmm. <coughs> what are your plans for? I used oil as chapstick today, and it actually worked. Not bad. All is that the one, one that you just use right yeah, now? Yeah, chapstick. My lips don't hurt. Oh, what? what 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 have I been doing? Yeah, what do you have planned for twenty nineteen? Uh um, twenty nineteen. Tell you the truth, spiritual, financial, physical growth. Are you gonna try to go on a ayahuasca? Oh, that'd be awesome. Oh ayahuasca. That'd be journey. awesome. That'd be no, I should have I should have did that at the beginning of the year. Uh-huh. And whatever. But no, I I'll probably do that next year. Some kind of DMT or something. To where I which oh. is easier to find. It's hard yeah, to find. Yeah, I don't know anything about that stuff. I bet you if we were in LA, that'd be everywhere. I, um, I watched this, um, or no, I saw these pages, because, mm-hmm. uh, I have Instagram. I don't know what the hell my thing is, don't ask for it. Um, but. Me or the audience? Anybody. <laughs> uh, I saw this thing where it's like flat earth theory, and I was like, alright, enlighten me. You know, let me let me try to figure out something uh-huh. or whatever because I don't think the Earth is flat. Personally, I I just don't. Whatever, and and may, maybe I've been manipulated enough to where I believe it's round. I don't know. It just doesn't make sense. Well, nothing makes sense. No, some things make sense. Nothing makes A sense. A lot of things make sense. The only thing that makes sense is if I smack you, uh, because you're dumb. <laughs> that doesn't make sense. <laughs> No, nothing makes sense, though. If you think about it... What are you it, talking about? A lot of things make sense. Why do we think we're better than animals? Because we're idiots. Yeah, exactly. And we can talk to each other. Yeah. But yet, dolphins know how no, to talk they to talk each to other. No, they talk to each other. Yeah, animals but talk we to can't each other. talk to them, but yet they can understand our language. Does that mean dolphins are smarter than we are? Yes. <laughs> it does. <laughs> Um, <laughs> they're like fuck that yeah. what are you guys dogs will understand this. oh okay I know what you're talking about but they bark and like I don't know what the fuck you said I, I ain't even, trying to learn it either I didn't even really know dogs really know what they're saying to each other, other I don't think they, I, don't I don't think know. they know whimpers but like actual barks they don't know what that is I think oh, you, you don't t- think it's a language no I just think it's the tone that they use you like, think oh, cartoons have been lying to me where they make the device and it talks and yeah on Up yeah it's a great movie um, I haven't seen Up yeah, so anyways, let me get back to this thingy oh, before okay. we change subjects like we like to do without even talking about <laughs> okay. it. Okay. Um, so yeah, flat earth theory, blah, blah, blah. Uh-huh. I start scrolling, and then, and then they show the earth is flat. Uh-huh. And then they show, wait a minute, we're not, whatever, we're not the full earth. Yeah. So now there's us uh-huh. and the continents that we know of, water around it, and then ice, right? Above it? No, no, on surrounding us, okay. keeping us in. And then they showed water and more land, like continents, all around it, and then more ice. I was like, what the fuck is this? So it's like... And then it shows tiny moon and tiny sun going around in circles in in here. And then it shows another sun and another thing going around out there. Yeah. That's weird. So it's, it'd be, it's like, a, like a target, like a bullseye. It's like a Petri dish. Yeah, but it'd be like a like a like yeah a bullseye yeah kind of inner yeah. circle outer circle yeah. So how <clears throat> so what the word we we just so happen to be the inner circle, yeah. just by chance. Yeah. Huh, that's weird. But it made me think like, hmm. That still doesn't make sense. No, it doesn't make sense. But it made it more interesting to where I want to learn more about it. What's the what else? What <laughs> other crazy <laughs> continent like, is there? Here's what: if we've never been outside of the, the ice wall. What? How are we supposed to know that there's another piece of land, and then another ice wall? We don't know. So how do you make? How do you just assume that there's another piece? Of, how, how did this person that made it just? Assume I don't know. That there's another piece of. I land don't know, but there? I like it. Because <coughs> even if it's not true, you're making a great story for me to write, buddy. <laughs> you're not gonna write anything. No, yet. I'm not. <laughs> but it's gonna be a brainstorm. <laughs> you act like you're gonna write stuff. Yes, exactly. I have. A, 50 books in writing as we speak. None of them will be written by the time I die. None of them. Thank you. Um, but just think about it, though. The storyline of that would be nuts. If we're all in the middle and then there's out and whatever, and then they're having wars out there, and then uh-huh. and then somehow their chaos that keeping us in here doesn't work anymore, and the ice walls fall down, and we're like, what the fuck is this? And then maybe the hologram that is the sky goes away, and we're like, what the hell? It'd be huh. dope. Good movie. I'd watch it. 
All three if of them. Had, if we had a battle between us and the outer... Yeah. Uh, who do you think would win? Oh, they'd win. Why them? Because they have UFOs. That's how they've been... Pew, 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 pew. How do you know? What, what makes you think they have UFOs? Because look, man. Um, the UFOs... <laughs> what do you mean? Like, <laughs> <laughs> I was like, wait, stop it. Did you just go... <laughs> they got lasers. <laughs> they made Star Wars happen in real life. They said, I like that movie. I'm making it in real life. I don't know, man. I, I'm just talking shit. Oh, man, there's, like, no end to that stuff, huh? No, there isn't. And I, and I like thinking about shit like that because, you know what, it's different, it's cool, it's interesting, and it gets my um, creativity going. I like creativity. So, if you're a flat earther, and but you're also a no, 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 denier. I'm not. No, 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 not you. Oh, oh, in general. Oh. Like if you're in, in a space denier, <clears throat> then technically you would say the moon is fake. Because don't they say the moon's fake? What if, what if the, the moon and the sun... Are machine tonight? Did you see how bright it is tonight? It looks fucking bright tonight. No, I haven't. It's pretty bright, but when you go outside, take a look at it. <clears throat> I was looking at it, I was like, what the hell is that big light? And then I look back, and it's fucking moon. It's bright as hell. It's almost yellowish. It looks like but, it really does look like But what if the moon and the sun were both just giant robots? Like mechanical? Yeah, just, okay, this is what we do. <clears throat> <laughs> you mean like like one of those stupid gear thingies where it's hooked up to the metal and they're just going in circles? Mm. That'd be the laziest piece of shit robot ever. <laughs> <laughs> no, but they're made they're made their purpose is to keep our plant life and shit. Um You know what I mean? Yeah, I do. I don't know. But it doesn't, but it doesn't make sense no, how we can get around. None of it makes sense. <sighs> and then no, none, also, of, none of the flat earth theory makes yeah, sense. Yeah, none but, of it cuz but it's interesting. <coughs> Cause that, even, that interests me. Even Jim Carrey was able to take a boat to the outer wall and hit the, the fake part of the wall. So oh, Truman Show? Yeah, so why wouldn't we be able to do that with our boats and whatnot? We have. Go to the edge. That's what you haven't learned. We have. There's a boatload oh. of people. Look, check this out. There's a boatload of people that go to the wall, uh-huh. and they all put their penises in the wall and hump it for submission. Up into submission. <laughs> I was gonna say, uh, and then here comes the aliens. Oh, they're up at the wall again, and they freeze their dicks in there. They get stuck out there, and they can't tell anybody Why? about it. And then they sink the ship, uh-huh. and bam, nobody knows about it. Is that what happened to all, all the people from the Bermuda Triangle who disappear? Fucking right. They all have fucking their, walls. They have their dicks yeah. in the walls. Some of them just lick the ice. <laughs> 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 These fucking shit the Wait a minute. Wouldn't our dick go the soft? Would Your good. dick would go soft. My dick never goes soft, bro. Oh, fuck that. I got the hardest dick there's ever been. Oh, that makes no sense at all. Oh, uh, shit. God, what the hell have you been thinking man, about, man? No, I have nothing to do. You sure you need to do drugs in the future? No, I don't. I don't. I don't need it. But I love it. <laughs> uh, I was going to do... I was going to call Q at 9 o'clock and see if we can... Who the hell is Q? Uh, Q. You know Q. Quinlan. Oh, do your little skit thingy. Yeah. Or not skit, but uh, what's it called? Not uh, skit. Urban link. Urban. No, 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 no. What's it called? Segment. Segment. Oh. Okay. Or what is it called? Yeah, I was gonna call it nice. Like, why not? Let's see what's going on. Is it called a segment? What is it called? Yeah, it'd be called a segment. All right. But I don't know if I want to because I have my phone on. Oh yeah, that's how you do it though. How I do what? Uh, your show, you record it on here and you record yeah, it on there. Yeah, but then I have to turn that off to call him. Oh, my crotch is showing too much. Y'all been it. looking at man bulge for a while. I'm <laughs> <laughs> oh, sorry. It was tiny. No, Fuck you. <laughs> <laughs> Fucking no, hate you, internet. That man, that man, <laughs> what'd you call it? Man crotch. Uh, what's it called? Man, uh. Mansplaining? No, no, no. The, the women thing? Manto, I guess. Camel toe, manto. Oh, I don't know what the male version of it's called. I would call it bull knuckling. Whatever. Bull knuckles. Bull hoof. Hoof. Look at these hooves. (laughs) My hooves. Look at my hooves. What a dumb movie. (laughs) Daddy, would you like some sausage? Oh, no, the best part of that movie, and I didn't even like the movie, but just the, uh, look at the, look at the baboon eyes with the sauce. And the, and the, <laughs> did I get the job? Did I get the job? You got the job! You got the job! Like the little picture he was showing that was drawing or whatever. Yeah. That was the best part of the movie. Like, it made no sense. I love it. Look at 
<laughs> Tom Green was a genius in that movie. Yeah. <clears throat> That's just a movie. Like, that movie, the amount it took to make the movie compared to how much it made, the ratio is so off. I wonder if that was a real elephant's dong heels jerky. <laughs> oh. Probably not. But it was so funny. Wouldn't he eat semen or something? Uh, yeah, I think he wow. did. What a character. You have to pay That's me another a... guy that disappeared off. You'd have to pay me a lot of money for me to eat semen. Like, a lot of money. Oh, uh, yeah. It's gross. I oh, I would do that. it. It'd just have to be a lot of money. That. Doesn't that's make, what uh, doesn't make me gay makes me a whore. That's what canceled that one show that Rogan was on. A gay whore, I guess. What? <clears throat> Tom Green? No. <laughs> 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 no, uh, drinking. Uh, well, oh, they made semen. Him, they yeah. made him drink horse semen. That's remember the remember when Dave Chappelle was on it? Yeah. Well, I guess it was a day on the Dave Chappelle show. <laughs> that Tyrone, crazy. these coals burned at over uh, five thousand degrees. Oh, Joe Rogan, you crazy. <laughs> God damn. <laughs> you have to eat this bull penis. Let me tell you something you don't know about me, Joe Rogan. I smoke rocks. Yeah. This is not the first penis I had to eat in my line of work. <laughs> Get the hot sauce. <laughs> what a great. Dave Chappelle. Great. <laughs> so what's what's next? I hear he's pretty... Uh, He's pretty cool at the comedy store, but like it's weird because they say like he'll walk in <clears throat> and everybody will just shut up and be like, "Oh my god, it's Dave And like he can't, he can't go anywhere and be and have normal and have people around him act normal. I think I'd act normal, but that probably annoys the shit out of him because I'm an annoying person. <clears throat> Maybe, but who is this guy? <coughs> I like Dave Chappelle. What are you, song bitch? <laughs> <laughs> song <Huh>? bitch. <laughs> What's wrong with that guy? That guy is a <laughs> racist. <laughs> I, uh, I would just start talking like him. <laughs> <laughs> I guess, is that normal? That's normal me, right? That's not normal me. <laughs> That's not normal anyway. Just be, just be saying stupid shit. <clears throat> well, I mean, you'd be saying stupid shit, but you don't have to say it in his voice. <laughs> well, I mean, I wouldn't say it in his voice, though. <laughs> what? What? What it made it sound like? No, I, I, every line I would say would be something to have to be related to the TV show. <laughs> it was funny when I didn't know Bill Burr was on there. On what? The uh, Dave Chappelle show. He was one of the guys that went off with the training. Oh yeah, 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 yeah. Bill <laughs> <laughs> Burr. Guys night out. Was like dudes night out. Yeah, yeah dudes night out. <laughs> dudes night out. <laughs> and they go, they go, and the guy comes back. He's like. Fuck it, I'm going back <laughs> yeah, in. <funny>. Yeah. <laughs> That's hilarious. That was Bill Burr when he still had hair. Did he have it? Oh, damn. Mm-hmm. I need to see that again. Oh, yeah, which, he was also the, uh, <clears throat> I think he was also the dad or something in that one skit. Oh, God the, damn. The, Let me get my crotch out, out of it. <laughs> He's weird. <laughs> well, because I look up to see what's going on, and all I see is guy guy crotch. Nobody's, yeah. Even if it's my crotch, I don't want to see it. But that's... It's still guy crotch. <clears throat> Man, you're fine. Dang, no. No, now you got that. You look like, what's his name when he did that one shooting for for Playgirl? Oh, uh, Burt Reynolds? Burt Reynolds. <laughs> <laughs> what what did he say? I, I spread my butt cheeks at, as Mike Honcho. <laughs> yeah, I guess. Talladega sure. Nights? I don't remember that part. Hey, uh, what is his name? What is his name in Talladega Nights? The Will Ferrell character? Shit, I don't know. Yeah, when he's, he's like, I just want you to know. I spread my butt cheeks. Did a full spread. Oh. As Mike Honcho. <laughs> as his what? As Mike Honcho. Mike Honcho. That was his name. Mike Honcho. As oh. doing the full spread. Oh, man. Woo, that stuff's spicy. I put a lot of cayenne pepper in it. Other than that, Hi-ya. what were we talking about before we went off the road? No. Oh, yeah, the stupid um, the moon thingy. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Not, I just brought it up because I just thought it was interesting. That I don't know. I, I, For a long time, and I don't know if I still do think, but I thought the Earth was hollow and there was land inside of the Earth with a whole other uh, continent and shit there. I don't know. Something about extra land that's un, undiscovered, like uh, Land of the Lost type yeah. shit, that interests me. You know, I, I want to I wanna believe in something else than what we know. 
even on our Earth. Like, yeah, there's a lot of area that we haven't discovered in the there ocean. Is a lot of area we and discovered. even in the Amazon or whatever. Let me put this bitch on silent. Bitch, I told you, shut your ass up. Why do you, oh, yeah, well. Oh, shit, somebody texted me. Well, yeah. Who was it? It don't matter. <clears throat> it's probably Nicole. Tom, where you at? It's too early to be watching porn. <laughs> what the fuck? Uh, anyways. Um, it's never too early to be watching porn. Yeah, I don't know who decided to say that. <laughs> that's a damn lie. Um, what the hell was I saying? Oh, yeah, just the thought of extra land would be cool. That is, that. Discover new land or whatever. Yeah, I mean, I want to hear about new new creatures being discovered in the Amazon and whatnot. Oh, yeah, yeah, that happens. <clears throat> That's what I like to hear. I like to hear about new creatures that live on the Earth. I'm pretty sure you could type it in to see how many, you know, species of whatever was discovered, discovered yeah, last year. Yeah, a lot year. of them are lame, like little bugs and stuff. I want something cool. Oh, dude, there's a lot of bugs. There's a shit ton of parasites and bugs. And Isn't there like millions of bugs just in a square foot a mile down? Uh, probably, yeah. That's crazy. A mile down? That's a lot of... Dude, can you imagine if... You know how Honey I Shrunk the Kids in that movie where they're fighting the scorpion and they're yeah. just helpless and they're like, fight the scorpion, dude! And it's like, dude! He's like, what the fuck are y'all doing? Like, <clears throat> yeah. That that scorpion would fuck us up. Oh, dude. yeah. That thing if, was closer. If, to- no, if an ant was our size and they, they they're not going to be friendly like this ant no. guy. They would be tearing us apart and throwing us in their ground to make us food for their kids or whatever. They just tear our limbs off in the park. They know, no, they know nothing of the thought process of being sorry or anything or, <laughs> no. oh, it's screaming. Let me stop. Actually, anything in the animal world hears a scream and doesn't even, like, nope. bat an eye. It's like, oh, yeah, that's its death cry. Watch it. Watch it cry. You want to hear some more? Watch, I'm just going to poke it. Oh, oh, oh. <laughs> yeah, I don't know how I rip off its screaming. No, no. We'd be dead. Quick. Yeah. It's so awesome. Bugs, bugs are awesome. Did, they were our size. They were... that? Wait, <clears throat> they made a movie about like big ants. <clears throat> but I was something brought me, made me remember. Do you remember watching that movie about the killer rabbits? No, never. I kind of do remember a little bit. They but were not like, really. <laughs> it was so horrible. They just took regular rabbits, but they made them look like they're huge and they're apparently killing awesome. people. <clears throat> they were supposed to be like really big rabbits, like um, shit, like those really big. Um, how big were they supposed to be? They're supposed to be like ridiculously big. I think like the size of cars. But <laughs> when they were shooting the movie, they would just show a bunch of rabbits running around, and and they just like what they would do is they like make the noise really uh, low, like bass. They just be like do 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 do. The rabbits are just like they're just hopping. <laughs> <clears throat> I hate that weird noise they make. <clears throat> and maybe this is the actual sound they make. I don't know. Maybe they actually just recorded. What noise? Um, spiders. When spiders are in movies and they're giant, they're and oh, and they're making those they weird, make this weird noise. Like, yeah, I don't even know how to make the noise, but it, it it's just like, do they really sound like that? I mean, if it was a cricket doing creak creak, okay, okay, I know what crickets sound like. I hear the motherfuckers all yeah, the time. I want to shoot the shit out of them, but they get too damn small. Um, but do but spiders? spiders? Actually make, I don't. I don't do know. they really make that noise? Like, if you put a microphone next to it, it's like, oh, look. Motherfuckers do make that stuff. That'd be <clears throat> kind of scary, though. Like, you put a mic to it and be able to hear it walking. It'd be, it'd be saying, motherfucker, got tired, tired of all these goddamn well, legs. <laughs> <laughs> That's what he'd be saying. Yeah. Tired of all these legs. Always tripping up a stuff. You ever had, you, you never had a tarantula? <laughs> no, I never had a tarantula. Okay, well, I've had a tarantula. And I don't, maybe it was just the way I was taking care of it, but it would trip over its own legs. <laughs> Like, you dumb motherfucker. What do you mean you trip over its own legs? I don't know. I think I spiked the water. I don't remember. That was kind of You cool. mean it'd be walking like all like that? And I was like, oh. Shit. No, no, no. It would be walking and then like it's like tripping over its legs like sometimes. Oh, like know. one leg would get tied up on the other yeah, leg? Yeah, it's like, oh, wait, that doesn't work. <laughs> Back to the drawing board. <laughs> <laughs> I didn't know that. Um... Did you ever hear about when I was living with Daniel when I was when I got kicked out of the house? Yeah. I think I was like what, fourteen, fifteen, something right? like that. So, anyways, uh, we had scorpions, uh-huh. and we're all like, "Man, scorpions are cool." We got two scorpions. Uh-huh. I was like, "Man, that's awesome." Let's go get another one. It's like, yeah, let's go get another one. <laughs> we went to go get another one. We put it in the same goddamn 
aquarium. <laughs> yeah. We're like, that's awesome. Look, there's three of them now. <laughs> we're like, yeah, three scorpions. I remember, I do remember and then scorpions and scorpions. We went to go eat something because uh-huh. we probably had the munchies. And uh-huh. we came back and the fucking big one ate the other two. <laughs> what you think was gonna happen? I don't know. I thought they were gonna be best friends and sing songs <laughs> and their tails. No, would... scorpions are, are. They stay alone. They're territorial. No, no, they don't stay alone. If they if they grow with whoever, they'll grow with them to a certain time and then they'll fight each other or whatever. I guess. Or maybe they do become he best friends. The other ones. He ate both of them. How big was he compared to the other one? A little bit bigger. <laughs> so not that big. Well, after he ate him, he was a lot bigger. <laughs> <laughs> it's like if he ate one and like. Uh, fucking ate a mushroom off of Mario, dude, dude, yeah. dude. Oh, really? <laughs> he grew that far? Like, he grew really fast after that uh-uh. first. I don't know. We just came back and like, where are the scorpions? And I think he ate one of them, and the other one was, like, hiding. Like, get me the fuck out of here. Because, <laughs> <laughs> like, we went in there, and he's like, what the fuck is going on? And he's, like, holding the claw. He's like, look, he's got three claws. <laughs> or, no, no. I, th- I think somebody said, like, he's oh, he's got, got a giant. He's got a giant claw in his mouth. Like, you know, because yeah. they got claws right here. Yeah. They look really creepy up claws, by the yeah, way. Yeah, they do. They got <laughs> claws right here. Were they the big black ones that they sell? Yeah. Those are the non-poisonous ones. Emperor scorpions are them. Yeah. So they have two claws, and we're all like, one of them was big. We're like, oh, shit. Uh, he's got a really big claw. And we're like, look, and I was like, oh, shit, he's eating what's inside of the claw. Awesome. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, <laughs> but but suck, because they are expensive. They're like $20. I was about to say, how much are they? They're like $20 and- a scorpion? Yeah, they were cool though. We we felt bad for that scorpion. Didn't dude. one of Daniel Spider's leg fall off? Yeah, they do that sometimes. <laughs> <laughs> they just lost his leg. Yeah, I'm they don't sh- go back either, do they? No, they do. They do? Yeah. I didn't know that. I thought once their legs crazy, gone, right? it's gone. No, when they shed skin. Yeah. Um, I get, I think it's already growing under their shell. Yeah. And then once they shed skin, I think it just comes out. Huh. It's kind of weak. It's like the small. It's like the small. <laughs> Uh, is it like Deadpool's arm? Yeah, there you go. Which is hilarious. <laughs> or Stan's legs. Remember when Stan's legs was growing on the American Dad show? Mm. You, you, I don't watch actually, American but Dad. But yeah, we actually watched this episode because he thought it was funny that he was running with little nubs. <laughs> oh, yeah, yeah. I did watch that clip. <laughs> yeah. yeah. <clears throat> uh, you watched some of that one. That show's hilarious. I can't believe you don't like it. Uh, Stan yeah. himself is annoying, but I mean, he's just a dumbass dad with a gun. He's not like Peter Griffin, stupid. But he's. What would he be like? I'm not sure. He's pretty much a security guard in the show. He don't do anything. Um. Anyway. Do you watch that Bob Burgers? Yeah, I watch Bob Burgers. I heard that's good too. I don't know. I it's don't okay. Watch. The kids are funny. The wife is super annoying. I can't stand the wife. But it's funny because she reminds me of Lily. <laughs> Really? Yeah. That was hilarious, though. Like, if you talk to Lil, oh, she's hilarious. Oh, Lily has some weird thoughts going on in her head. Well, I always crack up. When I'm around Lil, I crack up. She, she says corny jokes. Yeah, I love it. Her and Elsa, hilarious. Elsa is fucking funny. <clears throat> but, but her laugh is so annoying. <laughs> the way she laughs, like, like shut up. What? You gotta be so loud. Kind of like Sandra. Sandra laughs really loud. Uh, it's like, it wasn't that funny, Sandra. Shut up. No, that's annoying because it really isn't funny. It's like, dude. <coughs> yeah, um. Yeah, what's going on now? And you say you didn't like the Spider Man trailer? Oh, uh, yeah, there's a new Spider Man trailer. I'm not impressed. I mean, it's predictable. I haven't read any spoilers or anything. Did I already talk about this? No. <clears throat> well, not on... on. <clears throat> it just came out this week. Okay. So, I'm not into finding out spoilers and crap because uh, I'm not into that. I don't know. Reading whatever. Yeah. Like, I want to find out what happens. But anyways, I see the trailer and it's like, you're telling me what happens. Mysterials. Uh, spoiler alert, whatever. Uh, my thought. Mysterio looks like he's playing a good guy uh-huh. where most likely he's just a bad guy in disguise and then maybe Spider-Man finds out that he's the bad guy and then nobody else believes him or maybe I don't know, whatever. Maybe everybody else is convinced he's a good guy. 
And then he tries to stop him, and maybe people go against Spider-Man. That's what I'm guessing. <laughs> I mean, that's, that's pretty, uh... That's pretty lame. Easy to, not, not lame, but... I mean, he's just pretty much predicted any movie how it could go. They fight, and somebody doesn't like him. Yeah, but that's how they go. <sighs> well, the live stream finished, so I'm going to see if Q will answer. Okay, cool. Since I'll try this out real quick. Where is he? No, it's not. Shit, what am I doing? Anyway, keep talking. Yeah, but I, I don't know. I, I don't care for it. And and uh, there's a debate going on online with, in some groups. Yeah. And uh, they're saying Spider-Verse movie, that whatever it's called, Enter the Spider-Verse, was better than Spider-Man Homecoming. Oh, yeah. And I agree. All day. I haven't seen it. <clears throat> Homecoming or Spider-Verse? Uh, Spider-Verse. <coughs> oh. I mean, I don't see why it wouldn't be cool. I mean, it's just it, an anime. I version. don't know. Home, Homecoming was just meh. And then I hate, I hate that. Because, you know, uh, in Civil War, Spider-Man was awesome. Yeah. And then he gets his own movie and is, l- like, not as good. Not as, not as up to par. But in, he was able to keep his own in, in Captain America a little better. He was fighting Captain America. And then in this movie, Homecoming, he's fighting regular people and he can't keep up. Who did he fight, though? Like, who? Like, he fought the guy with the shocker thingy. Oh, yeah, yeah. And then he but fought... did he kick his ass real quick? Yeah, but it's just... It's stupid. I don't know movies, whatever. And then the same thing happened with with uh, Black Panther. Uh, he was way cooler in Civil War, and then he had his own movie. Yeah. And it's like y'all y'all dumbed down his fighting, y'all messed up his fight. And then even in Civil War or not Civil War, the next one, Avengers. Yeah. When he came back in Avengers, still. And it's funny because it's the same directors. <clears throat> you made him way better in Civil War than in Infinity War. And the same thing with Black Panther. He was way better in in Civil War uh-huh. than, than Black Panther. It's weird. He did a triple kick, which was fucking awesome. Oh, that was awesome. It was like the best movie he's ever done. What did he do again? What would the kick look like? It was like a kick, kick, and then yeah. a twirl and a kick. It was awesome. Oh, that's right. With that, that second kick, it was like momentum to turn around and <laughs> kick again. I don't think he'd do that in real life. Hell no. <laughs> no. I like how they made... Uh, how they made a movie though, Black Panther. It's pretty much a guy in a cat outfit. <laughs> He's a kitty cat. <laughs> I never thought about that. Somebody talked about it like, yeah, I'm like they made a kitty cat look cool, and I was like, what? <laughs> like, cause that's basically what Black Panther is. He's a cat, and a but cat cats are ferocious, dude. Oh no, fucking cats are mean. <clears throat> cats are so mean. If if the world ends, <clears throat> cats are gonna be okay. Let's see if oh, dogs no, are gonna get fucked. <laughs> They're going to be like, my bowl's empty. I'm so hungry. Dead. <laughs> yeah, dogs only live for so long before they get eaten by wolves. Or coyotes. Oh, yeah. Have you seen coyotes around the neighborhood? Uh, not around here. I saw one mom's, around mom's house. Really? Yeah. Damn. Did you feed it? <clears throat> no, I didn't feed it. And I didn't know how big they were. The thing was how like, big was it was it? like a, as big as Shogun. Please leave your message for... Yeah, he did not answer. <laughs> Our What's first it? attempt at... Uh, keeping up with no 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 that's not urban ergonomics no I forget what I was gonna call it I was gonna call it keeping up with the blacks but somebody said it was too offensive <laughs> sounds about right <clears throat> you gotta say Q is black that's why it'd oh, yeah, be Q okay is for you to say boy. stupid shit I'm not, I'm not saying anything. He's saying all. He's, no, he's you're gonna, gonna just tell me what's going on. Oh, I thought you were gonna him. ask him stupid questions. No, I'm just gonna, gonna tell, tell you. him. I'm just gonna be like, hey, so what's what's up with you know? Keep, oh, the black keep, community. Yeah, keep me informed on what's going on in black. You know, uh, black. Oh, I can tell you that right now. I think. I don't know. Maybe not. Okay. Well, what's going on in black? Well, <laughs> um, R. Kelly. Oh, uh, I don't get the R. Kelly thing. He's been doing. It's that hilarious. Long. Yeah, but it's hilarious. Like. I didn't watch the whole seven documentaries of telling me what I already know. But yeah. it was hilarious. Oh, no. Some of it was fucked up, though. I'm not going to lie. Yeah, some of it was fucked up. <clears throat> Even for me. And I'm like, man, all I want to do is put my big toe in your butthole. <laughs> but, uh, yeah, you're doing some weird shit there, R. Kelly. Um, but, oh, um, what's that guy? Soldier Boy? 
Yeah. He's back, apparently. He has a video game console out or whatever. Oh, I heard about that. Yeah, it's like a bootleg uh, video game console. Yeah, and he's like supposedly getting sued for it by <laughs> Nintendo. And I heard, but I heard he made another one. Or he, or he, he's doing an updated one, yeah. Or another one of he, Generation 2. Or whatever. Did he not know he was going to get sued for that? Uh, I don't know what he's thinking. But he's, he, he's hilarious. But apparently he, he talks a lot of truth even though he's... Crazy. Um, I mean, I want to see why he wouldn't talk some truth, but <clears throat> no, like he he says a lot of weird shit, but it's actually most of it is true or something. I don't know. I watched the Breakfast Club interview. I was laughing most of the time. You think he him, gets you think he gets so angry when you compare him to other people? Who Soldier Boy? Yeah. <clears throat> you think and him? Then he's like, man, I I <clears throat> paved the way. God damn it! Imagine if you got him and that one guy, uh, Tom McGraw, whatever the guy from uh, Blink One Eight Two together. Because Tom the Tom Tom. Is it Tom? Tom DeLonge. Tom DeLonge? DeLonge, yeah. Have you, like, you, you remember him from the Rogan podcast, right? How the crazy he was on shit drugs. he was saying? He was on drugs. He, I'm pretty sure he was on Adderall. Yeah, he was definitely, that's drugs. Yeah, but I both specifically went drugs. Because <laughs> yeah. I remember Rogan one time, like, two episodes later, he said, <clears throat> he's like, yeah, I've had some people, I yeah. can totally tell who's on Adderall. <laughs> yeah. Like, I can tell. Like, I think. Tom DeLonge was who he's talking I, about. I just well, I'm in the middle of uh, like I was saying, like put him and, and the Soldier Boy together in the same room together. Let's <laughs> just see what kind of crazy shit they think. Of. He'd probably try to fight him, uh, Soldier Boy. Yeah, he seems like he wouldn't back down. No, but I'm not saying that they'd argue about stuff. Like as far as like sh- it'd be like putting two two scientists together and watch them talk about science stuff that you can't understand. All these words that they use. I love it. I love it because. Um, Let's not waste words. Let's just uh, make weird words to know like what we're talking about. Oh, create our own language? You know yeah, language? why not? I don't know. Fuck it. I don't feel like, like doing that. It's too much work. No, no, no. Not us. I'm just saying in general. Just like, let's throw out some new slang. I, I like it. I think yeah, it's cool. see if it catches on. No, not us. I'm just saying in general. Like, throw out your own slang. No, anything I say, I don't know. What the hell have I come up with? I don't think, I don't think you're ever coming with anything. I'm sure I've come up with something, but it doesn't. Yeah. You know who comes up with a lot of shit Daniel does? <laughs> oh, Debo? De- yeah, Debo just comes up with some weird shit that he says. I remember. <laughs> Dude, when we used to get high back in the day and just talk about nothing, <laughs> it was the best. Yeah. I think he's married now. He's definitely married now. He's, he's calmed down a lot. That's good, though. The married life does that to you. Yeah. Uh, man, I was going to say something. Um, About what? Oh, uh, so I was watching the Joe Rogan podcast. Uh, Which episode? Uh, boxer guy. Tyson? Tyson. Pretty good. <coughs> yeah, I listened to it. It's pretty Mike great, Tyson. man. He's, he's funny. Yeah, he's awesome. <laughs> he's funny. He's funny, but he's, yeah, he's an awesome man. <laughs> A guy who, like, came back from some crazy shit that he did and then starts taking acid. And what did he say? What, did he say when the first time he took acid was? He was, like, 10, he said, or something. Acid? Maybe. Are you sure? No, I'm not sure. I think maybe he said it was, yeah, I think 10 or 11 or 12 or something. He was pretty young. <clears throat> That's a crazy age to take acid. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> No, but it was pretty cool though listening to him talk about like how he, um, how he's like not that person anymore, and he's you know he, he went on some, he did I think he took DMT also, and he went on this journey. And, That's cool. They're talking about how yeah, I mean, if, it's like if it can make Mike Tyson go from that crazy psycho guy that he was into a real calm person, maybe yeah, I should look into that more often. Maybe make it make it some kind of legal. Man, I do a lot of, uh, well, I watch a lot of ancient aliens. Well, I haven't watched it since last week, but I, I, that's still in my head. Yeah. And uh, this guy I know uh, told me about DMT and his experience doing it, and he saw the ant god and whatever. It had a lot of legs, <laughs> and there was insect, whatever. What? And he told me he looked it up, and it ended up being, um, like, back in, um, what are they called? Native Americans, I guess you would call them. I yeah. call them Indians. You know whatever they they live here <clears throat> they would worship the, one of the, the that's one of their gods or whatever uh-huh. <coughs> or spirits or whatever <coughs> the 
Spirit. And they and they the amp people took them underground and saved them from a a heat wave or I don't know what it was. I don't know. But then I, I like one of the uh, one of the when uh, climate change when that climate change thing happens every so often. Yeah. Right before the freeze. Yeah. Well, right before the freeze or after the freeze. Who knows? But I was like, "Wow, that's fucking crazy!" And then I was watching Ancient Aliens, and they were talking about that shit. And he had and it. He saw that in that's his what trip. He said, yeah. But that's what they say. You see, like you go like whatever. And you see other beings just hanging out or whatever and walking around and you see everything in geometric forms. Pretty much you go to another... Geometric forms, kind of like uh, the negative zone? I don't know. Yeah, I guess yeah, so, right? I don't know. No, I don't think like that. I think more like uh, tool covers. That's what he... That, who said that? That That's what the tool artist guy that does the covers, that's what he would do to draw... Thing. He would draw his DMT <coughs> trips. How long has B and DMT been around? <coughs> They've been doing it, man. <coughs> that ayahuasca shit is DMT, pretty much. Yeah. It's like and uh, they've been doing that shit. Ooh, who knows? That's crazy. I want to try it someday. I'm going to use the rest of the court. You keep talking about DMT trips. Uh, I don't got nothing to say. Oh, My name's so Gump. I like to party. <laughs> Yeah, so anyways, Metallica. I ain't got nothing to say. To, to myself. Just sit here and talk to myself, huh? Yeah. Ugh, wearing a green sweater. I found it in my closet. It actually fits. That's why I put it on. Oh, I was thinking about... Um, I, w I was thinking about this design at... Um, while I was at work. <clears throat> I was thinking about a design that, while I was at work. And it's... Um, it's a, just spit out. I don't know. Something hit my tongue. That was not cool. Um, it's a fucking cactus. Uh-huh. Um... Cactus. With a hole in it. <laughs> and it's it, like a glory And a cactus. penis coming out. <laughs> and the penis got thorns on it. <laughs> Prickle penis. What are you talking <laughs> about? Is that what you were doing at work? No, that's what I was thinking. Like I was like, man, what do I draw? Because I've been trying to draw more often. Uh -huh. And I was like, well, what's the best thing to draw than weird shit that I like to draw? So, that's yeah, true. I, I was all like... Okay, a cactus with a hole in it. The guy's fucking it. Uh, so he's got his penis through it, and it's got, like, fucking thorns all over it and shit. From the cactus? Yeah, of course, from the cactus. <laughs> where, what else? He already had the thorns there. He's giving the thorns to the cactus. Wait, I don't maybe know. put these thorns where they go. <laughs> or maybe it's camouflage. Is that what it is? Yeah, yeah. What's going to crawl on a cactus? I don't know. I think there is, like, lizards that call He's uh, trying yeah, to attract uh, lizards. He's on his penis. So that's what you thought about. <laughs> yeah. So pretty much he's fucking the cactus. I'm uh -huh. thinking he's fucking the cactus. Because, like, if a guy was in the desert for, like, 40 years and 40 nights. He'd be pretty lonely. <laughs> what did you fuck the cactus? No! <laughs> I still got my hands. I'm just going to jerk oh, it. Oh, shit. <laughs> did you say I had to stand on my hands? And find a way to jerk it? No, I said I still have my hands. I'm oh, jerking. oh, okay. But like, how the hell are you going to stand on your hands and still jerk it? Oh, you gifted. But anyways, yeah, so he's, he, I was thinking he's fucking the cactus or So it's just a cactus, the hole, his penis through it, uh -huh. thorns on his penis, and then on the side of the cactus, like his hairy butt cheek, just one hairy butt cheek, and then his pants down to yeah. the, the floor, and just his boot showing. And then like the, the That's cactus. very will, desperate, man. Yeah, the cactus will have like, uh, sombrero on top. Why does the cactus have a sombrero? Because then I was going to put Latino lover <laughs> on the side. <laughs> La no, Latin lover, not Latino. <laughs> uh, Latino lover. That 
It's hilarious, right? I don't know. I don't know if that Tina Lover would make sense on that. Nah, not really. <laughs> that doesn't seem like something. Except that he had like a. You know. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, it's just so stupid. I know. I love it. That's what you thought about drawing. Yeah. Did you ever draw it? Oh, I do have it here. No, that's not the good one. <laughs> that a dick? No, that's not a good one. <clears throat> Where's that? But I had a good one. Yeah, I didn't draw it. Let's just say. It. <laughs> Let's just say I didn't draw. Does that guy have chaps on? Oh, okay. No, no, they're rocks. I thought that was his legs. Let's see. I did the Latin lover. <laughs> and look, the lover is the spew from the from the semen. Yeah. <laughs> 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 that's creative right there yeah but I drew I drew it somewhere else um, I thought those were legs and it was running oh, that'd be <laughs> and hilarious. it had chaps on the legs oh. <laughs> <laughs> I think I'm gonna do that <laughs> <laughs> that's what it looked like to me I was like what is he running from yeah I'll finish the drawing and I'll show it next week I guess oh my goodness that should give me plenty of time to do it what do you think about that Godzilla movie coming out I haven't, um, wait a minute, the, 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 did they release another trailer? Uh, no, we talked about it last time we when, when they released the trailer. Have you seen the one on Netflix? Those are weird. Um, I saw the first one, it was kind of whack, the second one, I don't know if I saw the second one. And then the third one, I haven't seen it yet. Um. I watched the third one. I still haven't watched Baki the Grappler either. I love the original, I haven't watched the other one. I did watch something else on Netflix. Box is pretty remember. cool. I, I, it's kind of weird, but it kind of seems like the guys would take they take all this kind of punishment, and you think they're dead, and it's like, nope, they're not dead. They just come back. All it's like time. it's like Punisher the TV show when he got all beat up to death. Oh yeah, and he's still alive. Yeah, like and that. he's fine the next day. Like what the heck? How are uh, you yeah, walking kind of like that. Or, like, I, well, I mean, they'll not. come back bandaged up. Like I think in one of the scenes, the guy loses an ear. Oh really? Um, I don't think they sew back on. But, uh, yeah, I think it's, I'm not sure what the storyline is. It, it confuses me because I feel like some parts of it are him when he's younger and some parts are him when he's older after he won the tournament. And they keep showing clips of his dad just working out or just doing, like being all buff or whatever. That's all they do is show clips of his dad. Like they start talking about it. They're showing him like he's like sitting there. Uh, I think one scene he was like watching something on TV. He was just <laughs> doing it. Like his back was just getting all ripped. Do you know how it's supposed to have that demon thing on the back? The demon face? Just muscles? Yeah. Man, uh, the original, or not the original, because I think there was one before the one that I watched, but the one that I have from, what, the early 2000s or whatever? Yeah. That one was awesome. The dad was crazy. It was awesome. He would break deaths with just one kick and shit. Oh, yeah, yeah. It's it something. Awesome. It's, it's, I mean, it's still pretty cool. The fighting's still pretty great. Oh, is it? Yeah, so I would definitely watch it for you. It's pretty awesome. Uh, that guy, a lot of the characters are back in it, like Dopo. Uh, his son is in there with two people, and it's really weird. Yeah, I'm not fighting. I'm definitely gonna get back, get into that. I love it. It's weird because they meet up in like this one thing. It's like, okay, we're gonna see out of these six people who's the best. <clears throat> and they're like, okay, well, it, the you know the tournament has began or whatever the challenge has began, and they all like walk walk away. <clears throat> and so pretty much it's like. Pretty much watch your back. You're going to get attacked sooner or later. And you better prepare, you know, be prepared to fight to the death pretty much. But then you have the, the like the beat string of guys who, who, who want to be tough but aren't really in it. And be like, oh, I'm going to show up. And I'm going to kick your ass because I'm going to prove something. <clears throat> and then sometimes they do surprise you on how good they are. Sometimes they don't. Hmm. You remember the first episode of the... The one I think I let you borrow, right? The right. full DVD case. Yeah, yeah, I, yeah. You remember the first episode of that one? The one with the kid and mm-hmm. he gets jumped by those guys. Yeah, that's awesome, isn't it? <laughs> yeah, <laughs> he's like fighting fifty guys. That's and he awesome. Was like it was like a hundred, right? Yeah. It was like a hundred, and he was like, and he, and he got pissed off because he couldn't even beat a hundred. Yeah. Like I can't even beat a hundred. How am I supposed to beat champ of the world? How am I supposed to beat my dad? And then his mom was surprisingly weird. That their she, their relationship. Was she was weird. super stagged and shit. Yeah, she was. It was this weird. She she loved. She Bucky, was obsessed like, was with the dad. Yeah, like psycho obsessed. Yeah. That was that was weird. Um. 
Let me ask you a question. I did like the storyline plot, though, how, like, that one other guy was, like, from another mom. And what was the, the blondie, the Russian dude, at the end, who he fights to beat the tournament. I don't remember that. It turns out to be his stepbrother, or his brother, yeah, stepbrother, by another mom. Because, mm. you know, uh, Hiroshi, Hiroshi. I don't remember that. Hiroshi was out slinging dick, in other words. Hell yeah, he was. <laughs> Shit, wouldn't you? <laughs> yeah. The champ of the world, take this penis. <laughs> so, well, I, Where do I, I have, take it to? I have to a the theory. Clock. I have a theory that I never really thought about till just now. Like, he probably just slang dick wherever. And then but like, the, the, seed, the seeds fight each other? No, no. It's like, only only those two women survived that. Way. Like, the other women. Oh, the other women, died. Yeah. <laughs> like, after he's done banging, he just stands up, and they're just like a squished person. <laughs> ah, there's another one. Bill, this is all broken. <laughs> he was friends with the army, wasn't he? Uh, I'm gonna need a ride. <laughs> and he would just <laughs> jump off the building to yeah. hang on to the helicopter and ride off like off. that. Yeah, he was cool, Hanging man. On. That guy was crazy. By the leg, wasn't it? He was like hanging upside down by his leg. I think so. Yeah. But uh, that's what I was saying. I was like, maybe they're the only two that survived. That's a good one. <laughs> <laughs> All the other women Strong team. Ah, she was worthy enough to take by the sea. You get one, bitch. <laughs> I want more. Never. <laughs> Helicopter. No one has ever taken <laughs> twice. That's why he can't bang him the t- uh, two times. He can't have more than one kid out of there. They uh, can't. They're like, uh, yeah. what's it called? Um, where they can't have kids anymore? Uh, what's the word? <laughs> 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 yeah, I know. <laughs> exactly what Fucking you just said. Just tore up that whole uterus so bad they can't have kids anymore. Yeah, <clears throat> it's like one child. Yeah, fucked it up. Yeah, but they, they, there's no there's no kid coming out here to cut that bitch out. <laughs> Don't you bang me again? Bang what? It's gone. <laughs> I murdered it, destroyed it all. <clears throat> the semen like blows up the way in and shit. Yeah. <laughs> um, let me ask you a question though, because we were t- we were talking, we we're having a small conversation about it today. What? Man, I stutter nowadays. I don't know what's going on? Right what was the conversation about some medication? Um. Nintendo movies, man. Nintendo, Nintendo movies? Yeah. They're what trash. about them? Yeah, they are. Yeah, but imagine if they made a good one. Which one would you make that be a Dude, good one? Dude, of course, you'd have to make a good Link. Oh, that's exactly what I you said. You'd have to make The a first good link. one, right off the bat, I said, Dude, a Zelda movie would be the fucking shit. Lord of the Rings style. Yeah. But, you know, instead of those weird orcs thingy, he's fighting like pig people or whatever. Yeah. Make a CG. I don't care. It would be fucking awesome. Well, Him I, going to different... Those little, no, those little red things that walk around and shoot balls. <laughs> yeah. All that shit. <coughs> the ghosts and shit or whatever. But it would be him... Oh, the ghosts were cool. It would be, you know, the princess, whatever, getting taken, and then the king, whatever, I need a hero, or whatever. Somehow I he's chosen. I need a hero? Yeah. Somehow he's chosen or whatever. He chosen? Um, in the original? Yeah. He was just like, let me go into this cave. Oh, I found a sword. <laughs> yeah, this is what happened, right? <laughs> Like, and then you're on a journey. Dun, 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 dun. And then somehow you end up having to save the princess. Dun, 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 dun. That journey, right? Dun, 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 dun. <laughs> or was that all you're supposed to do to begin with? Dun, 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 dun. Stop doing that. Dun, 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 dun. Yeah, great. Um, I don't know, man. He just fucking went on a journey. Look, He's like, I got the sword. Now I can save the world. <laughs> There's probably like two that'd be really Oh, good. I'm not done talking about okay. it. Right. Yeah, dude. Uh, him going on a journey, uh-huh. and then going to castles and getting that crystal or whatever. Make it a make it a series. And at the end of the season, he goes and fights Ganon. Like a a TV show, like Castlevania. Yeah, movie oh, Castlevania cool, is good. By the way. That's Have what you I was seen it? Say next. The show? Yeah, the show. Yeah, it's pretty cool. Yeah. How they fucking kill his wife? That's pretty pretty bad, man. It's I'd a, be pretty pissed a, too. It's awesome. And all she was, she's, she's a fucking doctor. Yeah. <laughs> That's all she was. She was a smart bitch. Burn that bitch. She was a smart bitch. I just want to bang her. Burn her. Oh, did, is that what it was? One of the guys wanted to bang nah, her? Nah, I was oh, just okay. talking shit. Ah, oh, shit. She was hot. <clears throat> that bitch got Dracula dick. <laughs> 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 she got the Dracula dick. Stay away from her. We got to burn her to snakes. I always think, like, you know, vampires are pretty much just zombies. I mean, yeah. yeah. They just need substance. Yeah. Um. But yeah, they need that, uh, a Castlevania movie would be the dope. 
I thought you were still talking about Link, though. Oh, no, I was done. <laughs> oh, you, you, you stopped me from saying, no, no, hold on, I'm not done yet. <laughs> and I said two sentences. Link, no, but I think Link would be good as, as Link first, then Zelda uh, would be part two. I don't know what Zelda, you know, I don't know, I don't think you need a third one. I don't think you would need one. I don't know what he'd do after that. Because you can't It'd make be it like over. Frozen in time, because there's always thing. Well, in the new the new game, he was kind of like Frozen in time, and he had to come back and he How ended up Frozen in time. Well, he ended up. I don't remember the beginning because I played so much of it. I have 180 hours. I wonder. In that I, game. Might, I might I might Google like YouTube or something see if somebody can explain the whole timeline. I'm sure of they what's can. What's going on in Zelda? I'm sure they. Well, it's different. It's like Mario. It's different. Incarnations, I think. Incarnations of. Oh, okay. I see what you mean. Like you know, they have Paper Mario and regular Mario. Yeah. And Mario. I think so. Whatever. I mean, maybe it's all. If it's all tied <laughs> together, and that's weird. Because how does Minish Cap go into that? Because there's different types of Link. You know, yeah. there's Toon Link and other. Oh, Link. that is true. And then Retro um, Link. Well, Link would be cool. Zelda also Metroid. That was my second choice. Damn, me and you were fucking kind of alike. How the fuck that? Happened? I don't know. <laughs> Uh, but yeah, dude, Samus would be hot as fuck. Samus would be amazing. And then a space movie, like <laughs> fighting aliens, and it's normal. And she's a bounty hunter, isn't she? I think. I think so. Yeah. Yeah. I think she's supposed be... To be... What's weird is that they made the enemy a, a pterodactyl dragon looking thing. That's cool. But that's a pterodactyl dragon in space, dude. That's like common. That's how, <laughs> what do you mean? that's how aliens fly around <coughs> in space. They only use the UFO to get to the pterodactyl. Yeah, but it was like some kind of... It was bitch. smart, wasn't it? It, had a, it was a person. I think it, it would talk. A, a being, right? Yeah, I think it would talk, yeah. Well, it's the Metroid... Uh, the Metroid... Didn't it, like... Isn't it, like, take control of the ho- host? And it, yeah, yeah, it would take control of the host. Didn't it take control of that? I think that's what it did. I'm not sure. So it wasn't really... I don't know. I don't. It wasn't really the official bad guy. It was just the ultimate... I played Super Metroid, and I got very far in it, but I don't think I... The only one I beat was, like, Metroid Zero and Metroid <clears throat> Fusion. Those are, like, the only ones I beat. And those are Game Boy and Mance. Oh, they're on Game Boy? Yeah, I never beat the Nintendo one or the Super Nintendo one. I never actually fully played them all the way. Should... Mega Man would be kind of cool. Yeah, that would that would definitely be up there for me too. Mega Man would be fucking awesome with all the ro- with all the quick ass robots. Yeah, I heard that the other day when I was at a club bar somewhere. somewhere else somewhere when I heard that. That's weird. Yeah, Mega Man was playing in the background. Hmm. Have you been to any of those those uh, arcade slash bar places? You can play old school. Uh, Where isn't there one right here? <laughs> There's one in yeah. Is there one in uh, the Highlands? Right? No, no, no. Heard, well, there was one I in the Highlands, actually. One there. They made the Arlington Improv, where I do comedy at. They turned half of it into an arcade thing. Oh, really? Is it cool? I haven't been there yet. Oh. Because they stopped doing comedy. They stopped the open mics for a little while. Mm. They want to get, like, the crowd of gamers in first, and then we'll start the open mics again. Cool. But since I haven't been there all month, they're supposed to start in January. I haven't been there yet. Um, but they have one in uh, by the college. I've been, do you know where... I've been uh, to that, by the by the <laughs> post office, right? By the keg, so. by the keg, yeah, by the uh, keg place, cool keg or whatever. You've been in it, yeah. Did you have I've fun? been there. I've been there twice. Oh, the food's good, expensive, but I haven't good. Had the food there, and the beer is good too. I don't know your beer. So. Yeah, um, but the it's it's all right. Yeah, it's cool. Um, Cause I because you don't pay for the games, you just yeah, you just pay to get in. Yeah, and then you play them. <laughs> Excuse me. Nice. I do like the one in Dallas, too. Dallas. There's one called uh, Cider Cave. I haven't been. It's kind of far, though. I mean, you need to go. But it's funny because you got all these games and these retro games, but then you got all these hot chicks that want really? to play it. Yeah. Ooh, there's a lot of hot chicks What's there. that from Bad Santa where he's, like, playing the game? <laughs> yeah. You got Pinball's awesome, by the way. It was pinball, right, that he was playing? Uh, yeah. Yeah, pinball's awesome. I'm no good at it, but I, but I, I think it's I, cool. I, I think it's cool. You know what I mean? I, I'm, no, it's cool. I just, I, I don't know how to get good. Like, how do you, how do you get, how do you Who play knows? that game to where you're actually good it's at like, it? It's like, and it goes straight down the fucking middle. It's like, how the fuck do I reach this piece of shit? <laughs> fuck I, you, it game. It goes straight down the middle. Yeah. <clears throat> and it's weird because I, like, I know it's all about, like, 
getting the ball to bounce at the right spot or whatever. But I always seem to get it to bounce off the tip, and it always goes at one angle, and it's it keeps going it. in the same thing. Just, just hit the tip. <laughs> just, 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 just touch it. Just touch it. Just, <laughs> Just, 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 yeah, I'm like, just, just, just from scary movie, the, the second one or the first one. No, oh yeah, the first one. one. Just touch it, come on. <laughs> <laughs> I like how was, she was all like, yeah. He's like, she was all like, what are you doing? <laughs> like, what? <laughs> Good movies. Oh, the scary movies were awesome. I don't think they've made a a movie lately. Uh, funny, funny one. Like Wayne's? Yeah. Oh, Sean's doing his own thing where it's like a haunted house thing. I did hear about that one. The I first one it, was but... okay. The second one, I don't know if I watched it all. Oh, but it's funny because he has a cousin that comes over and he's gangster and he's trying to shoot the <laughs> shoot the ghost. Oh, that's the one where like the furniture goes up mm-hmm. upside down or something like that? Yeah. Yeah, that was pretty funny. <sighs> yeah, black people and ghosts do not mix at all. Do not like ghosts. Do people believe in ghosts anymore? Uh, I know I still believe in something's going on. But I don't know what it is because I've seen a lot of weird shit. And I've been like, I don't know about possessed. I mean, I never did, but I was I, I like the idea, but I don't. I never really did. Um, well, you know, we used, when we were young, me and uh, Devo and them, we used to hang out in cemeteries and drink. You guys, you guys would creep each other out, though. <laughs> like, you guys would just, like, grow on each other, scaring them. Nobody, <laughs> nobody sat there and be like, hey, guys, shut the fuck up. There's nothing going on. You guys would just, like, just feed off each other. No, but we would hear weird <laughs> shit, like bells and, and like, galloping. Wait, would you no think guy. you would, or did you actually Dude, hear? I was stoned out of my mind. Exactly. I don't know what the exactly. fuck was going on. You didn't have it. Like, man. You need a moderator for situations I need to go like home. That. My nipples are hard as hell. It's cold out here. <laughs> There's horses and bells. and Oh, but there was, that was cool, because that cemetery over there by that bank, or it was bank. I don't know if it's there anymore. That there's like uh yeah there's upside down. What are they called? Pentagons. Yeah. In the in that in the in the forest over there, hidden off in graves and shit. Yeah, but that doesn't it said, mean anything. No, and it, I think it said here lies the witch of whatever. And I was like, damn, that's dope. Fucking crazy. Yeah, but which? But is then not I think really something either. followed me home too, cause I had a hard like a lot of hard nights trying to fall asleep being fucked with. <laughs> nah, I, think I heard kids mind. and shit. No, I would wake up and be like fucking terrified and, and then it went from terrified to being angry because you get tired of these fucking kids <laughs> laughing at you pulling off your goddamn covers that like, shit's not funny <laughs> god damn it give my fucking cover i need to go to school in the morning <laughs> and talk to bitches because i ain't getting about. laid god damn it <laughs> that's not what you said uh, no nah, it's not but it would have been hilarious if you did yeah, say it that been funny i need a, a rubber band for my hair but whatever um so okay so Okay, but then, like, okay, what, 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 what cemetery what the was it? Um, and it's, it's like downtown ish. I know that I've been there, and but I've never seen like a wooded area close to it. No, no, there's like trees in the back area. Like, if you go in, like, because it's all gravel, right? Yeah, yeah. God damn, got a flat there, motherfucker. Because oh, so it's all like, you know, mud and shit. And you go back there, and then you, you know, go as far as you can, and then you walk. You just keep walking, and there's some trees and shit. There's a small, like, I wouldn't say wooded area, but just trees. And then there's a, yeah, there's a couple graves in there. Oh. Huh. Yeah. Well, see, when I was in high school, I went to <clears throat> one of the scariest cemeteries in Iowa. And because, and these cemeteries were cool because I've been to the ones around here and I'm like, these are lame because they're all like just like, flat. But the cemetery over there. Was hilly and shit? Yeah, what? it's pretty much, it was pretty. It's pretty much built on like, um, like big ass hills. So like if you so you, I, if you're at the entrance, you actually couldn't see the rest of the cemetery because their hills were were so much. Oh, cool. So you would that's drive a, like an episode of uh, I mean not an episode a level of uh, ghosts and goblins. <clears throat> yeah, probably because because you would drive around. It, it's pretty much built around a huge a huge a couple hills. It's cold. The cemetery was built around a couple hills. Yeah, uh-huh. it's getting cold in here for some reason. And. <clears throat> That was fun. That was always fun. And we would always go to um, this one spot where uh, where <coughs> they had buried. Uh, it was like a, a a place for orphans. Like, oh Where shit. they buried orphans, and one they had a uh, found a like a limb. I think it was, I don't know what kind of limb it was, like an arm or a leg or something from a, a that, child. That makes a limb. 
from like a child, mm-hmm. and <coughs> they didn't know who the child was, so they decided to bury it with the orphans. And it's called the Limb of the Unknown Child Grave. Oh fuck! And we that's used to go cool. there. Yeah, we used to go there and get high around it. <coughs> hey man, you need a hand? <laughs> <laughs> oh man, I'm gonna see. I'm gonna call this guy David J. He's from Iowa. I'll see if he remembers it. Be awesome. Does he answer? It'd be awesome if he does answer. Have you talked to him recently? I haven't talked to him in 10, 15 years. How the fuck do you have his number? Uh, Instagram. Oh. Follow him on Instagram. Let's see if he picks up. He probably won't pick up. It's late. It's too late to be. you high out of your mind? David! Rubenomics? What up, David J? What up, Ruben? Hey, hey, What's uh. Up, Hey, I'm actually on my podcast, and on my podcast I go by Uns. So if you say Ruben, nobody's, if you if, if you say Ruben, nobody's okay, gonna know. Ryan. What's up, Ryan? Well, yeah, <laughs> if you say Ruben, nobody's gonna know who you're talking to. Um, I was hey, I was doing my show, and we we're talking about graveyards, and we we're talking about how um, or we are talking about how the the remember the cemetery in Iowa that we used to go to a lot. Uh, the one on uh, bridge. Yeah, the one that where we used to have see the 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 limb of the unknown child grave. The cross from uh, yeah, the cross from the uh, the, uh, 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 the the school. Yeah, but like I was telling my brother yeah. about that grave and how we used to smoke a lot of pot over there and drink a yeah, lot. Yeah, that was creepy and shit though, <laughs> with the unknown child. <laughs> I know, but like. Uh, she was bad. But we never, <laughs> but like we never really scary. saw, we no. never really saw anything we scary. Saw, but it was always creepy as shit. Well, yeah, I mean it's a cemetery, it's fun. <clears throat> but like, like, cause my my brother go went to a cemetery. Tell him about the cemetery he went to here. Uh, what about it? The one with the witch and whatnot. <clears throat> oh, just that there's some graves with upside down pentagrams and shit like that. And oh, what would we hear? Yeah, I would hear like bells and horses and. Weird shit. Hey, there's also there's also the uh, the, uh, the uh, children's uh, uh, bridge. Oh, that's right. What was what was the you know, like, over there in Kelowna or whatever? Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Remember that one? Yeah. What was the bridge about though? It, I I can't remember. It's you know you, uh, the legend is is, is it pushed the, all the kids from the, the school bus. Yeah. Died and they pushed the school bus and you see, and every time any in the, in the car you parked there. Oh, that you know, one. You know, all the fingerprints. Wait, that that. All the kids. There's one of those there in Danport also. Yeah, it's like I don't know. It's I hear that like, in a lot of places, and they turn out to be fake. <laughs> Island or something? I can't remember. <clears throat> it's in San Antonio too. But yeah. It's real. It's real. Everybody I talk to, it happens. Oh, I need to go and check it out. I need to do this. Uh, what is it called? Little, Mythbusters little, myself. Yeah, little baby like, hamperets, bro. I'm pushing I, the car. Yeah, I've seen, I've seen Mythbusters um, bust a myth about that, but they didn't do the... I don't know if they did the baby powder or not, but... Uh, no, it's not babies. It's just kids. Yeah. Huh. It's kids. Small hands. Small hands. <laughs> small hands? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, just small, yeah. small hands, you know. Uh-huh. Yeah, to be on your fucking back bump, uh, bumper and uh, chalk and shit. Oh, shit. Anyway, yeah, I, I, I just thought it was funny to bring that up. And I was like, let me call David J. See if he remembers about this graveyard. Because uh, I, yeah, like... Yeah, yeah, I remember, I remember. You like, guys made, we all made, we all creeped each other out. Yeah, we would creep each other out. We did it to each other. <laughs> See? We <laughs> made it up. I don't know who made it up, but we creeped each other out all the time about it. Like, I, I know... I know now, like, even back then, I never really believed in ghosts or anything like that, And but it was creepy. Nah. But, like, now, like, I already, I still don't really believe in ghosts, but, you know, my brother Gump here kind of does a little bit. You gotta find, you gotta find a ghost. I gotta, I, I gotta find it. a ghost? I'm gonna take a picture you with a ghost, find... man. I'm gonna send it to you. <laughs> yeah, right. You gotta find a ghost. We're gonna, to gonna be, in. we're gonna be fucked up off tequila, <laughs> and I'm gonna be like, bitch, take a picture, Kyle. Hey, hey, eat some ghosts and you be chilling for days. Some what? <laughs> eat a ghost. Eat a yeah, ghost. Yeah. Me and ghost. Oh, you and ghost. Take a fight out of a ghost. Out of a ghost to be uh, for days. This goddamn oh ghost don't leave. <laughs> Motherfucker don't nah, pay nah, rent. Nah, that's what. That's I think that's one. what. Yeah, I think that's what people do. Like DM, DMT was make you see ghosts, and then 
Yeah, yeah. it's like oh, EMG shit. mixed with hallucinogenics. That's what ghosts are. <laughs> That's what ghosts are made out of. <laughs> Come here, ghosts. <laughs> All right. I miss you. Oh man, hey, I'm gonna I'm hit you back up here in a little bit. I'm gonna I'm gonna continue this podcast and I'll probably end it here in a little bit because it's almost ten. Heard that, heard that. Make some uh, copyrights onto my name. <laughs> <laughs> All right, I'll, I'll hit you in a little while. Okay, yeah, David. Later. <clears throat> yeah, I haven't talked to that guy forever. That's weird. You need to say how you been or anything. No, like, no, no. You just stop like. <laughs> All right, man, I'll talk to you tomorrow. This was 15 years ago, by the way. <laughs> All right, man. And then 15 years later. Hey, David J. <laughs> hey, Ruben. Yeah, tell me real quick about this, okay? <laughs> okay, I'll buy it. All right, man, later. <laughs> Doesn't give a shit. At- Do you have kids? <laughs> um, <laughs> Nothing. There's no fucks given. I know. That's awesome. At all. Just one time he, we were at the state fair, and we were both kind of drunk. But for some reason, the cop only decided to stop him and talk to him. I was like, are you drunk? And he's like, yeah. <laughs> and then they kicked him out of the same man. Yeah, man. I don't know what happened. I'm pretty sure he just got kicked out. He didn't made him leave. But they didn't bother me at all. I just kept walking. I was like, okay. Well, one time, um, since we're doing drunk whatever stories, um, one time Nicole uh, got pulled over. Uh-huh. And, and they took her to jail. <laughs> and I was fucked up And I was like Hey what's going on officers They were like what are those tattoos on your arms Like ah oh, man you know Just little doodles <laughs> Little doodles <laughs> And he was like alright man whatever. And then they're like, they're like oh we gotta We're gonna take her to jail man uh, So let me see your license I'm Like yeah here you go I'm all drunk and yeah. shit the window's all the way up I don't want to smell my alcohol over breath He's like alright man uh, well I hope you're safe to drive Whatever Oh man, I'm going around the corner. I'm fine. <laughs> <laughs> that's what we knew I was drinking. I was like, hey, all right, same trip. <laughs> <laughs> the whole time just being all chill I'm about it. up, man. That's probably like, he really doesn't care about him taking her to jail. <laughs> I wonder if they knew I was fucked up and just like, fuck know. it, let him go. I don't know. But they were, uh, they probably were like, he didn't really give a shit if we took her to jail. <laughs> Most guys be like, no, oh, man, sorry, baby. Baby, I love you. I'll come get you out. You're just like, oh, Dude, I got, man, that was cool. And, and at the time, I was living with her parents. So yeah. I get there, I pull up. Like, hey, man, Nicole's in jail. <laughs> <laughs> How did you get off? I drove off. I got fucked up. So. <laughs> Why did she go to jail for? She had warrants. Oh, shit. So I was like, I'm kind of fucked up, so I'm not going to be able to drive to wherever you want to go. Was she crying? Or was she just like, yeah, whatever. I don't know. She, I don't think she was crying. Most time women cry for that stuff. Yeah, she's not, the, she's not a crier like that. Yeah, we, some of them are crazy. I just thought that shit was funny. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, she's in jail. What did you do after that? Go to sleep? <laughs> I laid there. I was like, hey, is there anything you want me to do? I think I got like 50 bucks. <laughs> I'm like, nah, you go over there. <laughs> I don't think they ever liked me there. <laughs> but I never like, oh, I don't know. I guess I should ask them. But I was like, I don't want to be here. <laughs> the girl's yeah. like, no, nah, it's fine. Come on. Like, uh... What, when you moved in? Yeah. I don't even know how long I was there. What, were the parents still together years? when you were there? I think they, they separated. were. No, they were together and then they split up. But, um... Her dad but, was pretty chill. Yeah, he's still he's still chill. Pretty he's cool. cool. Um, I think I was there like three years or something. I don't you know. were there for a while. Yeah, and then you guys had that creepy closet that you guys were talking about. I was about. a loser. <laughs> <laughs> I still it remember, was. But, but Jesus, I was losing. <laughs> well, I mean, shit happens. Yeah, I mean, you you guys were together, and, and I mean, who wouldn't move it with somebody's blah blah blah? Me now. <laughs> <laughs> All right, with that, we're gonna end the podcast right there. Uh, I have to pee again. God, God really oh. got pee. Oh, we need to get the chance to talk about the fights. Oh yeah, fights. Uh, real quick. Um, it was an early stoppage. Donald Cerrone's a fucking animal. I he's um, a fucking beast. That that um illegal knee? that illegal knee. I don't think it was intentional. I think he really didn't know what was going on. Uh, I didn't get to see the women fight. Damn it! That's why you had the pride rules, man. Fucking and fuck, um, fuck him up with a knee. And uh, what was the other one? I don't know. Yeah, good. These are fights. Good fights. What are the, what are, what's next one's coming up? Um, Robert Whitaker and uh, Kevin Gaslin. 
Uh-huh. And then, um... Oh, and then what's the name fine, too? Uh, Kane Velasquez against Derek Lewis. Is that on the same card? Uh, I'm not sure. It's not a pay-per-view. I know that. Oh. I think uh, it, it is I'm hoping that. they'll do Donald Cerrone and, uh, <laughs> and uh, McGregor. That'll be pretty cool. That would be cool. <clears throat> Cerrone does want a belt. Yeah. All right. All right. With that, done. Deuce.